just like Chimo. Hey. What is it? My dad. My dad is there. Jesus. God, I'm dead. Hey! <laughs> Dad, Dad, you're welcome. Sir? Are you stupid? You are becoming stubborn and stupid and I don't like it. Get on to the car. They are fond of each other. Madam, you are not supposed to allow someone's daughter to stay in your house for too long. You want me to arrest you for kidnapping? Sorry, sorry. Common sense should have told you that we, the parents, will be worried and searching for her everywhere. Dad, I, I told that you allowed. Shut me. up! Get into the car. I said, get into the car. Sir, sir, please don't do anything. Okay, to... will you shut up? You know that you're blind now, Agaka. I told you. I told you I don't want your problem. Eh? Have you seen it? Have you seen it now? I told you earlier.
Oke. Oke, kasih awas. Hey, apa kamu? How are you? Tadi sih, so again. I love you, that's my name. Big girl, I like this, your music. Very sweet. It's a new job, it is. Yeah, a new song. It is not like a Sadeba and Fino. No, Remus. It's Abule Lukumba and Solista. To move in. Very sweet song. I want to release this song. Solista. The big current. Ah, okay. This boys again. What is their problem? Eh? Somebody cannot rest again. Every day noise, noise, noise. You can hear them. Nah, nah, those stupid boys who oh. don't come again, though. Eh? We love Abriya! 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 Check, 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 Which guy, which guy, which guy knows this one? Eh? Which guy knows this one? Eh? I don't know why they they know one person drink water, keep calm for 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 this, for this town. I don't I don't know why some boys are useless. Eh? Area boys, oh, they're just fighting, scattering everywhere. They stop the neighborhood up and down. Now they even kill two policemen. Eh? Yes, they kill two policemen, and now the policemen are everywhere looking for boys. Anybody they see, they will just arrest, mass arrest, massacre arrest, everybody. If they see you now, they'll pick you. Oh, God, flower. You know, consign me. What do you consign me? Now, me and my gates. I'm telling you. I didn't mind my business. If they like me, they can't do masquerade arrest. I mean, massacre, massa, massa, mass arrest. Mass arrest, arrest. You know, consign me. I don't know why some boys are just useless. Eh? Why can't they indulge themselves in something meaningful? I mean, work, make money, even if it's little, at least you're, you're doing something. Then this thing they are doing, fighting and scattering everywhere. Eh? You see? This me, I can't run. No. I, I won't even run like this. You know, I'm not too strong. Me, I don't feel run again. No. Me, I've, this is the last run. I'm telling you. You see why Ogano they come come this village? It, it's, it's obvious. You see, it's because obvious. of all this nonsense, what did they do? They portray Oga. Oga will build the house. The, the nonsense, youth, they do nonsense. They portray Oga come out. You know good now. Nah? I even hear say, Madam, don't carry belly. Yes. I know they say carry belly with the matter. They carry belly. The belly come come out. The belly come. They do madam flashing. They come. They go. They come. They go. They come. Are you mad? What is wrong with you? Eh? What is wrong with you? Can't you focus on your work? Eh? Why are you proposing? Who told you? Who told you? I beg. Get man. I beg. I know you gossiper. 
I don't like this kind of nonsense. Don't ever tell me this thing again, please. Just mind your work. Your work is to close the gates. You go back to your cubicle and leave me alone. Don't try this nonsense again. What if, madam? What if, madam is around? What will you say? They will sack you now. The little 15,000 naira you make monthly, you will just lose it like that. Because of too much talk. Please, don't try it again next time. Me? When they give you updates? Latest news updates? Na me, they call... It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I got flower. Don't call me again, I beg. Now you be the better person now. Why you See as your hand is, they, they smell hibiscus, 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 hibiscus flower. They roll rub from, 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 from my mouth. You want use idea, give me poison. I tell you, I be goat where they chop flower. Eh? If not be that music where they play, where they give me joy, eh? Me and you for, fight for this compound. You fight who? No, you, you fight who? Ah, they follow you play. They carry that 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 dagger. They come closer to me. Stay there. God, what have I done? Why is this happening to me? The worst of it all is that my husband isn't even concerned. I am the only one who is worried about this. What have I not done concerning this condition? What more do I need to do? God, please, show me mercy and prove the devil wrong. Okay, my boy, it will be now. It will be tomorrow now. I like it, man. Yes, tomorrow. Okay, Flana. Now, joke. I follow you, the joke, who asked my colleague. You, your body today, Pepe, you. You, they carry small thing for our head. You be man, no? I am still playing with you, too. I'm playing with you. I'm joking with you. So? I beg, bye bye. They go. Eh, bye bye. You, they go. Now, wow. Now, wow. Yes, okay. yes, yes. Talk. Okay, Flora. Hey. See, as person just the spoil person mood. I don't blame you. The only work where you submit now to the court, anything where God create, anything where God create, we're fine. You go just the cut them. You go see flower where they grow on their own. You go the cut them, say they design them. I have you. I have you. Eh? Cota! No, keep talking! Talkative! Yes, talk! Talk! I don't go talk! I don't go talk! I don't go talk! I go talk, you can find my trouble! My music now, you don't, you don't, you don't, you don't cut, I'm short! Oga! Oga, Oga, Oga! Please, okay, as, a, as, a, as, a, as a senior officer, sir, we need to change workers. We need to change workers. Maybe we know what they happen for this compound. Say this kind of better music why, why they enjoy. Say my follow you talk as, as my colleague. You just, you just spoil everything, spoil my mood. Me, sir, this kind of music, music, 
of people where they suffer. Okay, Okay, he's strong. Hey, I said he's strong. See, I don't wonder how you think they come back for this village. Okay. Whatever you want to say, make it snappy. I'm not in the mood. Hey, okay. Okay, okay. I, go, I go snap him. Okay, me, I don't wonder. I thank God for your life. I don't wonder how you think they come back for this village. Even all these basketballs killing, they just shoot anybody anyhow. I say, I say, thank, 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 thank God for your life. Okay, they try you. Even they do me like say you get all this. If they try, I swear. Meaning, are you wishing me death? Okay, I don't talk that one, no. If you die, who could they pay my salary? God forbid, no go die. So that's all you care about, your salary? Huh? That's all you care about, your salary? No, okay. Okay, okay. No, 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 sir. Sorry. So I, I, I wanted to remind you of, uh, of uh, your, your functions. You know, today is Thursday. You are supposed, when you come back around... Say the shut up. Shut up. Yes, sir. In fact, you make more sense when you are not talking. Okay. Now get back to your duty post. Okay, okay, sir. Come here. Where is my wife? Make her talk. Okay. So, sorry, sir. Uh, your wife, you never come back. You never come back. This one way too often, I just they work out anyhow. Me, they no come uh, uh, do something. I don't want you to say they, they shoot bed, a mama fly. You they important, your wife they important, because if you know that your wife go pay, pay, pay me my salary. My salary is very important. Before they go tell me now, say, oh, man, I don't use my salary, do barrier. Eh? Me, I they plan how I go take position myself, build my own house with the money where they pay me. Or for the madam. I know why they talk this thing. This boss. Okay, my own salary is, is important too. It be like say you go to pay me daily, you go to pay me per day, so that if I if you die on twentieth, I will collect. I will not say I don't collect the remaining ones. And they tell you they do collect them. No, no, go there. You go to pay me daily. All this mood and always comes with disadvantage. If you die, the mood don't go. Everlasting Father. Everlasting Son, Immortal Redeemer, Eta Glorify. Everlasting Father, Everlasting Son, Immortal Redeemer, Eta Glorify. Cleaning and watering the flowers. The pains are getting worse. How did you know? I am your wife. I know your mood. I know when something disturbs you. I know you that well. Yeah. But I'm fine. Okay? I don't want you to stress yourself about this. The pain will go away. Everything will be fine. But I'm good. It's more than a month now. Where is the pain going to? Instead, it's getting worse. Eh? I don't like to see you suffer. I don't like it. My love, calm down. I just told you uh, that I'm fine. I don't want you to stress yourself about me. I am fine. I am fine. I can take care of myself. Please. Guess what? what? There is food. And I made your favorite. Seriously? Mm hmm Wait. Okra soup and fufu. <laughs> you know what I can do. 
But this one, I added, you know, Bomo, Perewinko. It is not empty. Oh. This would, this would and I'm empty. famished. I'm, I'm hungry. What are we doing here? Let's go inside and eat. Alright. Like, don't no, fine. Don't worry. I'm okay. Yeah? It's okay. I'm fine. Let's go inside. See, you have to be careful. Ha! I hear the police are arresting everybody, all the men they see on the street. So, <laughs> you have to be very careful. Eh? Very, very careful. What are you talking about, my love? Do I look like someone that can fight a policeman? I can't even fight myself. I don't have strength. This thing you just said now, the police will not hear that one. So please be very careful. When you go out, just observe. Eh? See, observe. If you come out and you see people running, run with them. You hear? The food. I'm hungry. Let's go. You are leaving that behind. I don't care. Babe. Babe, at least say something. You can't be silent forever. Babe, say something. What do you want me to say? What do you want me to say? I'm tired of all this. We have been married for five years and this is your fifth miscarriage. Is it that your womb cannot Hold the baby, or what? I don't know. That means you have to check yourself. Because I am not getting any younger, and I want to be a father. If your next pregnancy ends like this, I swear, I will look for another womb elsewhere. What did you just say? So it's my fault? It's my fault that I've been having miscarriages? No, it's my fault. It's my own fault. Just just listen to yourself. Listen to yourself. You, you will get another womb. What, what do you even mean by that? You will get another womb. Alex. Alex. Wait. Say we say the evil, the water, the under. Eh? What is your problem? Eh? Can't you just mind your business? Hey. Ah, okay, flower. The only difference between they speak better English. There is no difference. There, there is no difference between me and you. For the same company, where be this compound? At the mind gates. Now, flower, you the mind. I know people follow you as my partner, as my friends, as my colleague. For the same company, yam like men to men. Who is your partner? Eh? Chidi, let me ask you, who is your, your colleague? Listen, I am not a talkative. I am not your mate. All right? And I, I have responsibilities. I'm a married man. Please, if you don't like what you're doing, I love what I am doing. This is where I, 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 I eat from. So, I don't like this thing you're saying every day. You keep on telling me about these people. Don't ever try it again. If they sent you, please, tell them you didn't see me. Focus on your job and let me be now. No problem. I'll focus on my job. 
you have marriage. You are, you are marriage. You are married. You have responsibility. No problem. You go soon die. No be only responsibility they here. Na 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 barrier rights. Barrier responsibility they here too. Eh? What did you just say? What, what did I just say? It isn't only you sabi speak speak grammar. Hmm? See yeah? For my school. Back in Iqbo, Abakeleke, for my school, why school? I they carry two positions at the same time. Only me, they carry first and second. Is it because I don't come here with my Baba quantitative and Baba reasoning? I go blow. If, if you blow, I blow. If you grammatize, I gra. I gra. Chill out. Hey! My English don't be messy. My English don't be messy. Okay, Papa. Okay, Papa. Hey, go. Madam! Okay, Papa. I beg. I beg. Madam, I beg. Madam! 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 We've done everything possible to keep him awake as long as we can. What exactly is wrong with him? He has a, a hyena bulging tissues around his intestine and he needs an immediate operation and it's not a cheap one. This hyena bulging tissue, what's the cause of it? Madam. If I wear you, this is not the right time to ask me a whole lot of questions. All you need to do now is to go home, speak with your husband, and raise the money for his operation. Please. Okay. So this operation, how much is it going to cost? It's going to cost a million. A, a million? A millionaire. That's a lot of money. We need to save the young man's life and we need to do it as soon as possible. His life is a stake. Yes. Not even 10,000. Not even 20. One million naira. Where are we supposed to see that kind of money? Eh? Money we have never seen in our life. Where? Eh? I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. And the doctor said I must... I must do this operation before the end of this month. If not, I may die. God forbid. Fiakwa. You will not die. You will not die. You will live. You will survive. You will make it. You cannot die. Hey. Eh? You survive. Chineke. Chineke. When this thing happened, what did your boss say? What do you expect him to say? He should have said something. Anything. So, nothing. Eh? I know what he wants to hear. See, Bobby, just go to him. Hi. Listen to me. When you get there, kneel down. I beg him, talk to him, so that he can help us with this money. If not everything, but part of it, so that at least we'll know where to begin to look for the remaining part of the money from. Eh? Please. I can't. I, I can't ask him for the money. I just can't. What do you mean you can't? I don't understand. Eh? The thing is, I... I would rather sell my only plot of land, you know, make money from there and then see how far I can, I can go with the oppression. But as for my boss, no. No problem. If that is what you want to do, no problem. Please, just do whatever it is you want to do first. I cannot afford to lose you. Eh? 
I just can't. I can't lose you. I don't want to lose you. Eh? Obi. My love. You won't lose me. I will not die. Okay? I'll be fine. I don't want you to bother yourself too much. I love you so much. I'll be fine for you. Okay? Nothing, nothing will happen to me. Hey! Don't forget to take our clothes to the laundry before you leave. I won't. That reminds me, baby. Did you speak to OK? At least to know how, how far with his health condition. Am I supposed to be calling OK? That's his problem, not mine. We all have our own problems. Besides, why are you worried about OK? He is our worker. It's our duty to make sure he's fine, at least concerning the operation. Listen, I have more pressing issues to think of. I'm okay. I will see you in the evening. Come here. Chedi, open the gate. Obim, my love, you have to ask him for help. You have to ask him for that money. This thing is getting serious day by day. That 300,000 naira we made from selling the land is not up to half of the money that we need. And you know it. I know. Yeah. But I have called my brothers. They said that they will get back to me very your soon. Your brothers don't have that kind of money. You know that your brothers don't have that kind of money. They don't have it. Why don't you even want to ask him for help? What is the problem? What is it? Axel. Your boss. No. I cannot ask my boss for help. Please. I know why. It is my problem. I can handle it myself. Please, forget about my boss for now, Biko. You don't want to ask him for help. Guess what? I am going to ask him. Yes. I will. What, what did I you cannot say? watch you die like this. What did you say? I will ask him myself. No, no, no. I won't let you do that. I will not. Will you stop me? Will you? Obim. What is it? I am your husband, remember? Please. I know what don't I am doing. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. My brothers will get me. back. Leave me alone. What is it? Look at you dying every day in pain. And yet you don't want to ask your boss. You know that he has that money. Why don't you want to ask him? Love, you're shouting. You just want to die and leave me in this village alone. That's what you want to do. Seven hundred thousand naira. Yes, sir. Seven hundred thousand. Yes, sir. No marriage job here. No. I can't squeeze out such amount now. No, 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 no. Business is slow. Business is slow. So please. 
Okay, please, sir. If there's anything you can give me, let me add to the one I have. You I would really appreciate, sir. You don't understand. I promise I will even pay back, ah. please. There is no money on ground. Business is low. Huh? 700,000 naira. No, 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 no. I can't, I can't squeeze out such money now. I have more important things to do with me. Anyways, let me see what I can do. Hey, thank you, sir. I did not say I will give you the money. I said, let me see what I can do. Thank you, sir. Go back to your duty post. Thank you, sir. Seven hundred thousand. My money job is here. One more scenario. I knew it. I told you. I knew it that that man can never help me. Huh? Forget the fact he told me that he will see what he can do. Are we not still here? No, tell me. Are we not still here? Where's the money? Why are rich people like this? Why would God bless a man and he will refuse to help other people? Eh? That your boss is very wicked. Oh. Very wicked man. Eh? How many years have you been working for him? And he, he cannot help you. It's bad. Very bad. Uh-uh. Eh? Tell him to take the money from your salary so that it will not look like maybe you are just borrowing the money. Let him be removing it from your salary. Salary? Eh? Yes. Did I hear you well? Tell me, how many months or years will I work for him to get 700,000 Naira? That is too much. Moreover, this man is already deducted my salary from the medical bills. So what do we do now? I don't know what to do. I am frustrated. I am confused. I don't know exactly what to do. My only hope and remedy now is on the people that, that promise they will get back to me. If they don't get back to me, fine. If I have to die, let me die. I am tired. I am tired already. God wants you to survive. But this money will not fall from heaven. It's not going to fall in our, uh, our front yard. We have to do something. We have to do something fast. Then what like do we do? No, you tell me. What do we have to do? I am the one going through pains here. Yeah. I am the one suffering. I need this money more than anybody. What do you think I should do? What? Listen, it's obvious that God doesn't care about me. Huh? You, you sound like you don't believe in God. I don't like how you're sounding. Eh? I don't like how you're sounding. You sound hopeless and it's not good. How do you want me to sound? Eh? How do you want me to sound? I'm just expressing my grievances. How? So I will just die like that? Huh? Nothing to show for? It's okay. It's going to be fine. Everything is going to be fine. Can you just stop feeding me with those hopeless hopes? Hopeless hope? Yes. I am not fine. I will not be fine. I don't even have a child to call my own. A child that will be there to answer my name when I'm gone. Will I just die like that? After everything, I will just die like that. No air, no hope, nothing to show for God. Is that how you want me to die? Is that how you want me to end my life at this young age? What have I done to deserve all this? Because he's very sick. His condition is, is worsening by the day. If he does not have that operation, he'll die. Huh? So we have to help him. Mercy. Yes, my love. Learn to mind your business. Hmm? Yes. Learn to mind your business. Is this what you're supposed to be saying? Eh? Madam Miscarriage. You should focus on conceiving. Get pregnant, put to bed, make me a father. That should be your priority number one. 
not talking about something that has nothing to do with you. Mind your business. Unless I am your wife. You're, you're, you're saying these mean things to me. It's, it's not fair. But that, 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 that's not a problem. But you see that young man? He has been working his ass off day and night in this compound for years, as long as I, I, I can even remember. And this one time, this one time we were to cut him a little slice, you, you, you are being this mean. If you are done blabbing, motivational speaker of the night. Alex, it's not fair. It's not fair. You have the money. You will not eat your money. Help him. Help him. Conceive. Toy me. Conceive and put to bed. Like well, make me conceive. So all these ones, well, what have I been doing? You have been doing it wrongly. You've not oh. been doing it the right way. Eh, yes. Okay. Don't worry. I will test it elsewhere. Huh? Oh yeah, make it now. One touch like this, a clue. No sense. So that you to focus on your problem. Focus on your problem. Conceive and put to bed and make me happy. No, you are here questioning me. Will I help you? Is that supposed to be your You're business? You're just being mean. You're just being very mean. Even Baro pushers have I have kids up and down. You can see Vumba. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know whether you have a leaking wound. No sense. So this is how this guy now says me. He can't even stop to say hi to me. <laughs> Uli, Alex has moved on. How long has he been? Sometimes you need to let things and people go. You will not understand what I did for this guy when he was in the university. So he cannot see me and, and drive past. <laughs> My sister, that guy never loved you. He never loved you for one day. Let me tell you something. Eh? Sometimes our emotion let us do things we don't want to do just because of love. <laughs> he will never understand. True love never dies. <laughs> you need to be happy. Because the most important part is that you have a man and he has a woman. And your husband adores you. It's not what I meant. He's my first love. He's my first love. You can't compare my first love to others. The memories keep coming through my mind. So are you telling me you don't have true love for your husband? <sighs> You know what I'm saying? I didn't say that. Uh -huh. Then let it go now, because he has moved on already. Let's go, I beg. Cheer up. Hmm? Oh, please leave me. Let's go. Ah -ah. Married woman, where are you going? My dear, I am looking for money. What do you mean that you are looking for money? Why did money develop legs and start going around the village? I have crisis at hand. There is trouble. And if I don't comb this village now looking for that money, somebody might die. Huh? My goodness, is it your husband? God forbid, bad thing. Why, why will you wish my uh, husband a uh, bad thing? Did I say it was my husband? Did I call any names? I didn't uh -uh. wish your husband anything now. And besides, do I know what the crisis is all about? Eh? So, what's the crisis? What kind of crisis do you have? My dear, for now, it's still on a low. I cannot disclose the issue. Mm. It's still internal. Eh? I can't tell you people about it, but maybe much later if we have resolved everything. Mm. Yes, I will tell you what it is. Mm. No problem. Yes. Okay. Mm. Take care, yeah? I would have asked people for the money, but ah, I know you people don't have. No, yeah, I don't no, have money. No, no. no problem. Oh, yeah, I'll no. come and see you guys. Hey, hey, well, take care. Yes. Okay. Bye bye. All right.
Excuse me. Good morning, sir. Have we met? You look familiar. Yes, sir. I'm okay's wife. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. I must say. Okay, my gardener. Yes, You're his sir. wife. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. I was like, I know this face. I know this face, but I couldn't place it. So how are you, my dear? How is it okay? What are you doing around here? Same issue. You know, since we've not been able to do the surgery, I went to get a um, harbor so that we can use and relieve the pain. The woman does not stay far from here. That's what I went to buy. Uh, no, no problem. Let, let me move to a bit. Yeah. Yes, sir. Thank you so much, sir. You're welcome. Thank you. What is keeping my wife? Does it mean she can't locate the place I described for her? Huh? Ah. That woman is suffering. My wife is going through pains, suffering just because she wants me to be alive. God, please help her. Help me. I don't want anything to happen to her. I don't want her to be a widow at this, at this early stage. Please, God, please touch the heart of my yoga. Touch the heart of my boss to help me. I know that man has the money, but I don't know why he doesn't want to help me. Please touch his heart for me. I don't want to die. Huh? The pains. Pens is too much. That means my own. <laughs> Such a beautiful name. You have to direct me because I don't know the way to your people's house. No problem. Just go straight. This way? Yes, sir. Okay. So how is your husband's health? It's getting worse every day. Mm -hmm. But what can we do? Very soon, okay will not be able to come to work again. But he has been doing his job perfectly well, and I've not seen any sign of weakness in him. My husband is very good at hiding his pains. I'm the one that lives with him. I know him very well. He's good at pretending that he's strong. Meanwhile, he's not. Uh -huh. Sir, hmm? please, is it possible for you to help us with this money? I will be very grateful to you, sir. Business is slow. I already told you, okay? Business is slow. I can't give anybody money for now. For now. No problem, I understand. But I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. Nice environment. Thank you, sir. 
Okay, thank you. Thank you, sir. Do you still know your way back? Mm, yes. Bye-bye. Just because I asked him to help our gardener, he started using all sorts of nasty words on me. Am I responsible for the miscarriages I have heard? He now threatens me with my condition. Something will happen for this compound. And that thing will happen for this compound. No, they war. You know, they happen normally. See, see as Madame did. Make I, make I, make I go. No, I don't want problem. But it's my job as the security officer in this compound, not only to mind the gate, but to mind the whole compound and the person with the inside. Make I find trouble. Make I, make I dress well. It's more time now. I go begin the shower. Make I dress well. I'm not waiting to worry my madam. Madam. Are you crazy? Uh, madam, uh, uh, sorry, no verse. Eh? As in I ask you, uh, are you okay? Are you mad? Are you sure you're okay? What does that even mean, if I am okay? Is that what we pay you for? To move around and ask stupid questions? Hold on. You've been observing me for a while. You've been looking at me. For how long? No, madam, madam. I can't be, I can't be looking at you. To looking at you, me say, are they, are they are you? Eh? No, I can't be looking at you. If I look at you now, I can go sack me. Eh? It's, it's my job to move around, make sure say the compound they okay and everybody. What exactly do you want? What? Uh, I want to. I, I, nothing. I, I just say make I know whether they're okay. You're crazy. Yes. Something is definitely wrong with you. Look, my eyes are closed. Before I open them, just get out of my sight. This minute. Okay, no, no. Get out! I said get out! Madam. Idiot. Even the bread where you give me, rats don't shop up. I said get out! I know how they think manage myself. You know it's you know easy for me too. You know easy for you, you know easy for me. If I say make I come here you give me food again, I go shout. Nothing why I go shop. No, I, I, I manage myself too. You to manage yourself. Can you imagine? Is it the color of his uniform that is affecting his brain? Put your trust in God, oh. Fine woman will not get people. If the prayer remains, just help me too. Bye-bye.
my lovely wife. My joy. My queen. My long life and prosperity. Thank you. Thank you for taking good care of me. Why are you thanking me? I mean, it is my responsibility to take care of you. You are my husband. Oh, God bless you. God bless you for me. Thank you. But why are you sounding like this? Did I do anything special? Have I done anything out of the ordinary? You will not understand, my love. You know they say, a good wife is worth more than gold. Your love for me is real. I can feel it. You love me unconditionally. I can see your love. Your love is real. I mean, look at my condition. I'm a poor man, but you love me. You are not poor. You are a very hard-working man, and that is why I love you. Why are you saying all these things? Why are you sounding like this today? Because I love you. I am intoxicated by your love. Should I tell him Izoka brought me home? Are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. Let me go get your medicine. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Who will I leave my beautiful wife for? Save me, oh God. Ah. I'm so excited to have you on my bed. Thank you, sir. What's the meaning of this? I... I think you were lost in thought. I was lost in thought and so? Can't I have space in my house again? Sorry. I... I just... thought... You know what? Just excuse me. I need to be left alone. Why are you getting angry? Oh... Can't I get angry again? I said leave, I need to be left alone. Just go. Why are you behaving like this? Why wouldn't I behave like this? It's five years since we got married. Not even a teddy bear, talk more of a child. Are you not a woman? What's all this? No, tell me, is that not enough reason for me to get angry? Look, babe, we have to keep don't, don't, don't tell me that bullshit. Don't even give me that crap. Oh, I see. You're waiting for me to die so that you will enjoy my wealth with another man, right? It won't work. It will not work. You'd rather die first. Wait, don't, wait. listen, don't even touch me. Don't touch me. Prove yourself if you're a woman. 
Five good years, not even a, a teddy bear. Talk more of a child. Eh? You keep telling me, let's try. Try what? I ain't go off no way. I ain't go off no way. Five years. Five good years. And I go off no way. Babe. Baby. My husband is so relaxed about his condition. Now he has gone to work instead of making effort to see how we can raise money for his operation. I cannot keep quiet and watch him die. No. I love him so much. I have to do something to save his life. Maybe I should talk to his ogre myself. Yes, he can give us the money as loan. I should talk to him. Yes. Is there a problem? Yes. You are the problem. Why can't I have peace? Why can't you allow me have peace in my own house? Why? Are, are you by any chance saying I am depriving you of your peace? Yes, you're bugging me. I left the room for you. I came here to meditate. Here you are bugging me. Sometimes a man needs space. That doesn't mean he's cheating. I am here to meditate. Leave me alone. Ah! Okay. Happy meditation. The same to you. Huh? <coughs> My husband already left for work. Is he not in your place? I'm not here to see your husband. I'm here to see you. Mm. Relax now. Stop looking at me like that. Can I sit? Uh, yes, you can. 
thank you. Is anybody home? No, no, sir. Okay. okay. Have I told you, you are naturally beautiful. <laughs> thank you, sir. You're welcome. Mm. Oh, yeah. I want to leave Somebody show me the way of life I don't want to No dwarf, no dwarf No competence say you find no You no find at all I see him, I see him Chidi, what is it? What did they do you? I'm fine, can't you say I'm fine? You find you can't keep this like a person where she's the one You can't do you can't do worker like this Now some person will find the worker Chedi, I'm fine. Please. Huh? Oh, Gaffa, you no find anything. No, they like it me. You no find. Eh? See, 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 just the worker. Because they tell me, say, say, say you find. That's, that's some person will find the, the worker. Uh, did, I, did I complain to you? Oh, Gaffa, you no find. You no feel to like it me. Say you find. Person will find the worker normally. <laughs> Madam, good afternoon. Good afternoon, ma'am. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Okay, how are you? Yes, ma, um, I am fine. Uh -huh. You see, me and madam, we don't catch you now. Me and madam, we don't catch you. Madam, okay, no fine at all. Oh, okay, flower, no fine at all. Now lie in the line. Okay, may I see you briefly inside? Okay, um, madam, but uh, I am done for today. Uh, I was just about changing my... I won't take over. much of your time, okay? Come now. You still talk. You talk too much. You talk to avoid me. I am not your brother. We don't look alike. Why are you putting me in trouble every day? See yourself now. You know fine. Go may they give you medicine. Sorry. You know fine. Eh? Go back. I'm, I'm, I said we fight. Mind the fight. You know fight. You can't fight. You can't, you won't come fight. Hey. Madam, you know fine no. Give him bobo ni say and brass them on. Miss him. But madam, if na food where you won't give him, me I know fine no. I hear as madam they fried chicken. They smell everywhere for compound. Madam, me, I know fine. It's in a food. Me, me too. Me too, I know fine, no. If not drug, if not medicine, I find. I find. If not medicine. No, while I find. You are naturally beautiful. Thank you. I was driving by, so I decided to breeze in and check on you. Okay. Uh, that reminds me, I saw your husband, his condition is getting worse. We it's might lose that man, or his condition is getting worse. Now I understand what you were saying. That was what I was trying to say. He's just managing. Don't worry, I will help. Eh? Yes. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Heavens is going to bless you. Thank you so much. Eh? Uh, leave heaven and God first. You see, in life, nothing goes for nothing. Yes. Even in free town, nothing is free. I will help your husband, but on one condition. Uh. It's not easy to bring out such amount of money. It's true, it's true. My business is struggling. So it's not easy to squeeze out money. I deserve something in return. It's true. This money you are talking about, I, I know it's not a small amount. And it's not easy to bring out that kind of money. But the problem now is that we have sold our land. We don't have anything, no collateral, nothing to give to you, sir. Please. No, I'm not talking about property, no. Mm. No, you are the asset now. You are naturally beautiful. 
So what I want us to do is this. Allow me sleep with you. Let me enjoy this year natural beauty. And I'll bring money for you to save your husband's life. God forbid. God forbid that I will cheat on my husband. But Never! I will also cheat on my wife now. You want to sleep with me? No, this was your plan. That is why you left your house, where you know my husband will be busy cutting grass to come and sleep with his wife. Lower your voice, lower your voice. Use what you have to get what you want. If your husband dies in that condition, your conscience will flog you forever. His people will not forgive you. If you want to meet her, let me enjoy. You save your husband's life. With all due respect, sir, please leave my house. Please, sir, come and be going. Think about it. I will not think about it. Leave. You are naturally beautiful. what I'm thinking. If what you're thinking is what I'm thinking, then we are right. We both cannot be wrong. We cannot. This is not the first time I'm seeing Aleska drive out of Oke's compound. Wait, I thought Nkem said that she had crisis. Let's what kind see. of crisis that her husband rich boss cannot help her with? Huh. Or is he capitalizing on the frequent to stay in this village? I'm lost though. My instinct doesn't lie. Don't worry, let's go. One day, what is hidden will be exposed. Exactly. Uh -huh. So let's go. Go and leave them. Oh, 
So you are covered you with the blood of Jesus Christ. Blood of Jesus. What is it? Huh? What a dream again. I'm fine, I'm okay. It's okay, it's okay. I'm fine. Nothing will happen to you. Nothing will happen Nothing to you. Nothing is going to happen to you. Amen. Nothing will happen to you too. Okay? Let us sleep. with everything I had. Stop. Stop it. <coughs> stop sounding this way. Obim, stop sounding this way. Please. You're scaring me. What is this truth? It is the truth. I'm just stating my, my present reality. It is not your reality. It is our reality. You and I, we are going to fight through this. Stop it. <coughs> it is my reality. Fight it. Who is lying down here helpless? It's me. Who is going through the pains? Still me. It is my reality. <coughs> I know. I know I will eventually die. That. Are you trying to say that the help I render is not good enough? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Is that what you're trying to say? I am not doing enough. I am not trying to see you leave. Is that what you're trying to tell me, Obi? That is calling me. That is calling me. I will face it, babe. 
It is my reality. I will face it. <coughs> Somebody help me. Somebody help me. Hey. Somebody help me. Hey, I'm losing my mind. Don't know what to do. Somebody help me. Every day I'm going down. Still no solution. Somebody hey, help oh, I. Somebody help me. Oh, Somebody help me. Somebody help I don't want to die I want to live Somebody show me the way of life I don't want to die I want to live Somebody help Cause I'm losing my life in my mind don't know what to do Somebody every day I'm going down still no solution somebody hey, oh, I, somebody help oh, I, somebody help me somebody help me Hello, sir. It's me, Kim. Okay, his wife. I was th I was thinking about you too, sir. Sir, my husband did not go to work today. He's really sick. You said that you are going to help him, right? You help him. He's dying. And he's dying. I accept. I will do it. Where should I meet you? And you're going to give him the money afterwards, right? Oh yeah. Mm. I don't want to die. I want to live. Somebody show me the way of life. I don't want to die. I want to leave somebody else. Father, forgive me. Forgive me, Father, forgive me. I am sorry. I am sorry. Forgive me. I have no option. I do not have any option. I have no option. I have no option. I have no option. We have an option. What are you doing here? I'm crying. 
we are supposed to be lying down, my husband. What are you doing here? It gives me no hope if I keep lying down. The only option we have is for me to stay alive. I have to be fine. I have to stay alive for you. I need to be strong, my love. You will not die, okay? I will do everything possible to make sure that you leave. You are not going to die. I know. I know. Please, my love, I am, I am hungry. I've not eaten anything since morning. I want you to prepare something for me to eat. Plantain precisely. Unripe. Huh? Boil it for me. Please. I will. Let me eat so I can take my drugs, okay? Please do not stress yourself again. I'll be fine. Alright? Careful. Alright. I'll be at the front stage. Yeah! Hey, I'm losing my mind. Don't know what to do. Somebody Every day I'm going down. Still no solution. You not believe what happened this afternoon? What happened? I confronted Alice. Do you know what I asked him? What? The frequent visit to Oke's house. And he could not believe that I asked him such question. Wait, wait. You mean you stopped Alex? Yes, now. What, what did he say? He did not say anything. He just entered his car and left. I think Alex is up to something. But don't worry, we'll find out one day. Definitely. I pray. Yeah, we'll be. We'll find out. My love, I will, I will stay a little longer than usual today. Um, my boss wants me to supervise um, a package delivery. And it takes time before that supervision has been done. Okay. Um, just be careful. Yes. I'm fine. Where's your medicine? I, I have it inside. Okay. Because I can't forget it. And I, I, feel, I feel free today. Like, I feel a bit free. Leave. That's good. Yeah, I'm strong. I'll be calling you. Okay. I'll call you from time to time, okay? I love you. I love you too. All right. Why? I want to walk you. This young man promised to be here before 9 a.m. So what's keeping him? What is keeping him? Ah. Honey, you're still here. I thought you've gone. Not in here. As you can see, I'm still here. So, what are you waiting for? My late mother. What kind of reply is this one? Eh? Can't you mind your business for once? Am I a baby? My friend, what kept you so long? Sorry, sir. What sorry. kept you so long? Sorry, sir. Uh, sorry for coming late, sir. It, it was because of the, the medicine I took last night. Stop wearing this cap in my house. Sorry, sir. Follow me. Yeah. 
He still hasn't called yet. Eh? Good. Just... This man sent my husband away just so that he will not suspect anything. And yet he hasn't called me. What is going on? Eh? to call me for me to meet him. What is he doing here? Natural beauty. Aha. Uh -huh. Natural beauty. Nice. How was your night? Uh, sir, you know I'm not fine. I'm not fine. Very soon, very, very soon, everything will be fine. Relax. See, are you here to pick me up? See, don't even pick me up. Just go. Tell me where to meet you so that we'll carry KK and meet you there, please. We are not going anywhere. We are doing it here. It's safer now. Do you want someone to see us entering a hotel? Jesus Christ. In my matrimonial home. Does it matter? Your matrimonial home or not, does it matter? The most important thing is that we are going to make love. So whether it's on the air, Kitchen, parlor, couch, it doesn't matter. Is that why you engaged my husband? I yeah. needed to buy you some time. I told him not to leave until I return. This is not right. This is not right and you know it. Can't you help us without sleeping with me? Can't you help us? I don't care whether it's right or not. The money I will cough out, is it right or wrong? No, no, no. The money I will use in saving your husband's life, do you know whether I borrowed it from a deity? Don't stop trying to blackmail me emotionally. We're talking about your husband's life here. Yeah. So let's go and make love. I'll give you the money. Simple. I don't want you to look as if I'm forcing you. If you're not interested, let me go. Oh, you're about let me hold my money. Huh? Sir, please. Okay. Yes, I'm fine. How is your health? Um, I'm, I'm managing ma. May I have a word with you briefly? Sure, with all, with all pleasures. I'll be waiting in my room. Your room? Oh, there's something I really need you to help me fix. Oh, okay. Okay, ma. No Wait. problem. Now. Okay, I am, I am behind you, ma. Crying now, I don't like this. Stop crying. Don't make it look as if I'm forcing myself on you. Uh -huh. Agreement is agreement. We are here for something crucial. Start. Nah, eh. Okay, let me go. No problem. Go. You can do it now. Uh -huh. Now you're talking. I'm only crying because I'm about to betray my husband on our matrimonial bed. This is not betrayal, darling. It's not. 
You are doing your husband a favor. You are trying to save his life. It's okay. If doing this is going to save his life, just, just do it. Just do it. You look more sexy, William. How do I explain this to him? I need to save my marriage just like he needs to save his life. Come in. Okay. Um, I'm sorry, ma. I'm sorry for wasting your time. It's okay. Are you done washing his clothes? Yes, I am. I am done. No, I am I am fine. It's I can't okay. stand. You can sit. Madam, I should sit. Yes. Okay. Okay. Madam. I need a favor. And if you do this favor for me, I'll make sure you have that operation to keep you alive. Do you understand? Uh, yes, ma. What, what favor do you want me to do for you? Anything at all, so long as it is within my power, I, will, I must do it. Thank yes. you. Are you expecting visitors so I, I should clean everywhere, even the backyard? Mm. What I'm about to ask might sound a little crazy, but I am helpless, you see. I really need your help, and I know that you can help me. Um, I need you to get me pregnant. Huh? Jesus. Jesus. Okay. Jesus, madam. Ah. Okay. I am. Um, let me. Let me start going. No, no, please. Let me start going. Don't, don't go. Don't you want to leave? Look, if you do this for me, I promise you, I'll help you get that operation. Huh? Madam, please, uh, please, I beg you. I love what I am doing. This job is all I have. I don't want Oga to kill me. Hey, God forbid. No, 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 I can't do it. I can't do it. I, I, I love my wife so much. Please, if I do anything with you, that means I have betrayed her. And I love my husband too. But I am out of options. Huh? Madam, please, I beg you. I, let's. Please, let's just forget about this. Eh? I will never tell Oga that you, you told me something like this. Please, I, let me just go. You will not know. Madam, please. It's going to be a secret. Hi. Hey. Please, please. No, no, no. Oh. You're, su you're such a sweet woman. Hey. You know how sweet you are? <laughs> Natural beauty. <laughs> Natural beauty. Organic. <laughs> Natural. <laughs> it's too sweet, Abel. Hi. Please go. Please. Hi. Leave. I, I beg you. you. Stop crying now. It's not like you, you, you favored me. No. You did your husband a favor by saving his life with this. Uh, How can you call this abomination? A favor? What kind of favor is that? What kind of favor is that? It is favor now. Okay, you want your husband to die? No, 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 you want him to die so that another man can have you food. You did him a great favor now. Ah, let's call it this happiness. Are you always this wicked and mean? I'm not wicked and mean, I'm just stating the obvious. You saved your husband's life with your powerhouse. You did well. People should congratulate you. So don't let your conscience flood you. You're sweet, eh? I love you. You gave me some more. <laughs> Take care, eh? I love you. Bye.
Habib. Habib, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're welcome. Thank you. No work today. What's your business? Huh? What's your business? Work or no work? What's your business? Are you lacking anything? Or do you want to spoil my mood? No. I am sorry I won't ask next time. Better. To your turn to Israel. This is unbelievable. This is unbelievable. <laughs> oh, Guinea. How could she be that sweet? Ah. <laughs> he just told me to come tomorrow and, and take the money. Just like that. Ha! Ah, my love, I am I am so happy. But he, I don't know why he was just uncomfortable around me. But what God cannot do does not exist. Tomorrow I'm getting the money. <laughs> what do you mean uncomfortable? I mean, his mood, the way he was behaving, he was just uncomfortable. I know he wasn't okay. I, I, but I can't tell what really was Okay. Mm -hmm. You wanted money. Now he has offered to help you. You are complaining about his mood. Is his mood your problem? Mm -mm, not what is your business with his mood now? What is your concern with his mood? Eh? Please, when you get there tomorrow, collect the money and don't check mood. Don't check his mood. My love, what is it now? Uh -huh. uh -uh. Are you angry because of that? Obim, you don't want to enjoy this soup with me? Huh? My long life and prosperity. Why is he angry? You should be happy for me now. This is why I'm getting the money tomorrow. Huh? Eh? Oh, babe. She gone to. He came. My wife. Where are you? What is it? As you can see, I'm busy. I know. I haven't come to disturb you. I only came to tell you I am pregnant. Wow. That's good news. You're pregnant. How many months gone? Three months. Three months gone. That means you have like um, two more months to have another miscarriage. Mm -hmm. Five miscarriages, mercy. Five miscarriages. This is the sixth one. 
and you are still proud to tell me you're pregnant. Is that supposed to be a news? Come on, say something new. Alex, why are you treating me like this? Why are you doing this? Why are you, why are you behaving like this? Is it my fault that I, I've had all these miscarriages? No, it's my fault. Is it my fault? Put the blame on me. No, tell me now. Is it my fault? Yeah, 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 you're pregnant. And so? Is that supposed to be a news? Knowing fully well that you will have miscarriage in the next few months. Please. Alex. You're pregnant. What's the about that? What are you for? And I go like petati in a J. Good afternoon, okay. How are you? I am fine, ma. Good afternoon. Thank you. I have good news. Good news? I am pregnant. Three months gone. Sorry. Sorry, ma. Is there a problem? No, nothing. Aren't you going to congratulate me? Oh. Congrats, ma. Congrats. Thank you. Pregnant. Three months ago. Look at you. Where are you going? Uh, I was just moving around. Okay. Uh, uh, I'm so tired. Uh, yes. I need to. Uh. Since you're home, let's go inside so you rest, okay? Exactly. Should I tell him now? Um, are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. Are you sure? Mm. Obim. Mm. Obim. 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 Are you okay? I've been observing you lately and you're not okay. Tell me, are you sick? I'm fine. Why are you throwing up? Talk to me, you're getting me scared. I'm pregnant. Huh? You are what? You're pregnant! Yes. Hey! You, you're pregnant? Yes, I'm three 
months gone. Wow, three months! Yes. I yes. Same thing with my madam. Three months? Yes. Oh, I mean, Is everything not it? Of course, of course, I'm happy. I'm happy. Oh, I love you. I love you so much. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. So, I, I will soon. I will soon be a father. Yes. This is this is the best news ever. My love, thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I'm happy. Ah, you're pregnant! <laughs> this cause for celebration. Let us go inside. From now onwards, I don't want you to stress yourself again. Yes, inside please. Inside. My wife is pregnant. Ah, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Let us go inside. Ah, three months pregnant. Uh, mm -hmm. okay. God has answered my prayers. Inside. 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 Walk like a queen that you are. Majestically. My long life and prosperity. Go inside. Hey! <laughs> I'm happy. I am happy. You have remembered me. I will soon be a father, neighbors. <laughs> my love. You're welcome, my love. Hmm. So how is my baby doing? She is fine. <laughs> Are you sure she's fine? Yes, she's fine. Did you hear her heart beat? <laughs> I'm so excited. You know, I'm surprised because this pregnancy is the only one that has lasted to this point. Me too. I'm so excited about it. Very soon I'll become a father. I'm happy for us. <laughs> Thanks for making me proud. You are welcome, my darling. Oh. Times have I warned you not to stress yourself again in this house? Eh? You want to kill my unborn child? Mba, biko, 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 don't stress yourself. Anything concerned, sweeping, cleaning, pounding. Biko, don't do it again. Please. Obi. Uh -uh. If I don't pound, how would you eat? Please, you can boil rice, any other thing, but anything that concerns pounding. Cleaning, sweeping, or doing any hard thing in this house, let it stop. Ha. I beg you. Obim, eh? you want to make me lazy. And you just want to make me lazy. You don't know that these small, small things I'm doing keeps me busy. It will give me energy. I don't so want that... you to do it. Please, listen to me. I don't want you to do it. My love, I cherish you so much. I love you so much with all my heart. I don't want anything to happen to you. Please, listen to me. If you if you must pound, let me know on time. Okay? I will do it before leaving to work, but don't do it again. Opie. Yes. <laughs> My love, can you just please go inside? Eh? I don't want you to I don't want anything to happen to you, Biko, Biko, hey. Biko, Biko. I am not in that mood. I can never be in that mood. Obi. Long life and prosperity, please. Obi. My long life and prosperity. Go inside and rest. Hey. Please, let me do this one. Eh? Leave it for me. I've heard you. Yeah. 
Easy. Easy. <laughs> See my own born child. You want to. Which way are you taking? Back or front? Anywhere? Okay. Move, 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 move. Gradually, my queen, move inside. Move inside, please. Thank you. Inside, inside, eh? Go inside. Just go in and rest, eh? Go in and rest. Uh. Obi, oh, Miss Anything on fire? No need to ask you. No need to ask you. I'm back. No more work in this house. Hello? Who is this? I'm fine. Who is on the phone? Yes? Why are you calling me? Yes, I am pregnant. And why do I need to tell you that I'm pregnant? What for? Sad. I'm almost due in nine months. Why should I let you know now? Why are you even still calling me? Eh? Please, I don't want trouble. What is all this now? Eh? Thank you. Thank you, sir. Bye bye. This man wants to put me in trouble. Please don't block his number, safe. Why should I tell you I'm pregnant? Mama, mm -hmm. this one you are pressing my belly like this. You've been checking, checking, checking. What is the problem? You might be ready. Ah, ready how? Hmm. This ready. pregnancy that clocked nine months yesterday. Ready, ready for what? Okay. Uh, we will go to Mama next place. Hey. So go inside mm -hmm. and pack your things. Let's start going. Mama, oh? Mama, thank God you saw me outside. I am tired. I'm still trying to catch my breath from where I went to. I'm tired. I cannot start going anywhere. You can please ah. go inside and get ready. Mm -mm. Mama, I'm tired. I cannot start going anywhere now. My legs are still swollen. I'm still trying to catch my breath. I cannot go anywhere now, Mama. You can, ah. you can please go inside and get ready. Let's start going. Mama, oh? no, no, nah, Mama. You can please enter inside. <sighs> Come, let's go inside. I might put to bed any moment now. We will suspect me if the baby doesn't look like him. That has been my worry.
She will give birth in a week's time. A week's time? Yes. I told you. Mama, you scared me. You were just saying you are ready, you are ready. Thank you very much, Mane. You are welcome. Thank you. You are welcome. So bring her back in a week's time. We've done everything possible. Your baby's happy cannot be heard. What? He is dead. What? That's okay. No, it's not okay. My husband, he's going to throw me out. I can help you talk to him. No, 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 no. That, that there is no talking to my husband. You do not understand. There has to be a way out. Something, something has, something can still be done, right? Anything. There has to be a way out, how? I'm sure there are other women who come here to give birth, and you. you oh, know. mercy, please. We do not do that in this hospital. I cannot do anything to tarnish the image of this hospital. It took us years to build. Doctor, we cannot. Doctor, please. Maria, you have to help me. Else my marriage will be over. Please. Mercy, please, if you know someone else, maybe other hospitals that could help you do that, you can go ahead. But please, my friend, we have to do everything possible to remove that child because it's not healthy to carry a dead child in the womb. No, no. I am not taking out this child until I am ready. Messy. Good morning, sweetie. Food is ready. I'll be there in a second. Better hurry up. <laughs> Dad, hmm? don't forget to follow them as that's please so we can buy base cake. We've not taken that route for three days now. You seem to have a soft spot for that girl and her grandma. Mm. Or is it all about their sweet account? Or is there something you're not telling me? Dad, nah, I just like them. But I like their, I like the taste of that piece cake. Mm. Mm. You know, I know when you're being mischievous. And I think this is one of those times. Daddy, now nah, it's just about the beans cake, not too much. 
Are you sure? Mm. All right, let's go. Chede, open the gate. Good morning, sir. Adam, how are you? Fine. Good morning, ma. Esther, Rita is here. Hi, Esther. Oh, Rita. Hi. Baby, how are you? I'm fine. Well, okay, give us 1,000 naira. Oh, 1,000. Almost put all my akara. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. Mm -hmm. Bye bye. Bye bye. Mama. Yes, okay. Are they going? Yes. Oh. Bye. There's something special about this connection. What about but so much commitment? There is something about me and you. Like that magnetic. Well, I cannot play safe. Yeah. Just like sisters, yeah. you're my bestie. Yeah. I wanna be with you every day. Yeah. There's something special about me and you. And I call it a great bond. Great bond. Between me and you, you're like a sister. And the bestie. Great bond. A system between me and you. Something unexplainable. I like Peter very much. She seems very nice. Mm -hmm. She is extremely good. She is good. I just wish I could see her. Maybe she's pretty. Look. Don't worry. No? It's your food. Later we'll discuss that. Okay? Uh, it's a great bond. Mm -hmm. There's something special about this connection. What about but so much commitment? There is something about me and you. Dad, I want to be friends with you. I want to be real friends. There's something special. Hi, Dad. Dad, I feel she's lonely. I need someone beside her. She has a like grandma. Mm -mm. Dad, I need someone her age. Like me. Mm -hmm. I like Babe. Hmm? Did Rita tell you about wanting to see Esther? Oh. She told you to? Yes, she did. <laughs> She's serious about it. Very serious. And I think we should allow her. You know, she's just a young girl who feels for Another young girl her age. Hmm? 
And the girl is less privileged. Okay. No problem. She can see her. I can even take her there myself tomorrow. There's something special about this connection. What a bad, but so much commitment. There is something about me and you. Like a magnetic But I cannot place it. Just like sisters, you're my bestie. I wanna be with you every day. There's something special about me and you. And I call it a great fun. Did you mean you? You're like a sister and the best thing. Who is that? It's Rita and her father. Ah, oh, Rita. How are you? I'm fine. Lady, how are you? I'm fine, thank you, sir. Thank you so much for bringing my friend. <laughs> You're welcome. Um, my daughter said she wants to spend a day with your granddaughter. Oh, uh, that's very fine. <laughs> but, um, I brought this thing. Thank you very much, my daughter. Ah! Thank you very much. All right, um, I have to run now, eh? Okay, Dad. If you need anything, just call me. Sure. Thank, thank you. you, thank you very much. Come inside, come inside. Okay. Let's go. How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> How are you? Oh, it's good. <laughs> let's go inside, let's go inside. Bye-bye. Bye. It's a great bond. Mm -hmm. There's something special about this connection. What a bad, but so much commitment. There is something about me and you. Like a magnetic fire. But I cannot place it. Just like sisters, you're my bestie. I wanna be with you every day. There's something special about me and you. He's nice. Mm -hmm. Carry your my money, make you carry me go some visa. If I touch your body, make you touch under my shirt, Nikke. And get your love, don't blind me, I go be like Baba Fryo. If I call me Sasha, you go Ari, my empire. Ah, Grandma, you say. Grandma. I'm not going to You people should behave very well, eh? I'm going to the market. Oh? Okay. Bye. 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 See, we have the old house to ourselves now. <laughs> so let's listen to more music. There is something about me and you. Like the magnetic fire. I cannot believe you go where I don't know. But my beloved, your body cool my pressure. <laughs> There's something special about me and you, and I call it a great bond. Great bond between me and you. You're like a sister, I'm the best thing. Great bond, a system between me and you. Something unexplainable. Great bond. There is this connection. You no, know, it's really fun walking around like this. Although I do it alone, but I like it, you know, especially when the breeze is cold. Are you okay? Hmm? I'm fine. <laughs> You're I'm sure? okay. Let's go. Why are you laughing? Listen to this. You will like it. Put it to your other ear. Take it. Yeah. Do you like it? It's nice. I think I've heard it before. Of course, it's a popular song. Everyone has probably heard it. But wait, let me change it to this one. Come on, let me change it. What of this? No, I don't <laughs> know it. This is actually my best song, my favorite song. Wow. Mm -hmm. It's nice. Don't worry, I will teach you how to sing it. Mm -hmm. 
Money the first for me. Say I never call you see. I don't know. Every day I will pray for you. Make you Baba God bless you. I'll never forget. So that was what my grandmother told me. She said, my father died a few days before I was born. He died in an accident. And the accident destroyed his body that he couldn't be recognized. It was only by his clothes they were able to recognize him. And my mother, she died after my birth. That is really a sad one. I'm, I'm, I'm very sorry about that. It's okay. But my grandma, she's trying her best, you know, to teach me things. And I'm very happy. <laughs> my dad. Oh, my dad is here. here, yeah. Dad. Yeah. Dad, how are you? I'm fine. Hope you have fun. Yes, Dad. <laughs> Good day, sir. Good day, how are you? Welcome, sir. Hola. Um, I'm happy. Thank you. Thank you. Take care of yourself. Thank you. Thank you so much for coming. <laughs> Bye. 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 All right. All right. Yeah. Mama, help me sit down. Are you crying? Oh. You are crying. You are crying. This is tears now. Stop crying, okay? No, she will call some other time. No? You are not crying. I, I just, just smile for me. Smile. <laughs> <laughs> I wish she could see me and everyone around her. I wish he could see me. Who? Oh. My friend, Esther. Oh. Mm. You say, sweetheart, you don't have to beat yourself over this. It's not your fault. I can't stop thinking about what she told me. About how her parents died. Her father died in an accident while her mom died while giving birth to her. It just seems like we are sisters. That is so sad. Hmm? But then again, these things just happen. No one knows why God allowed these things to happen to her. What's why? Why will God allow such a thing happen to her? It's too much. Sweetheart, come. Listen. We cannot question God. Okay? okay. Mama. Do you know that Rita was really nice to me yesterday? I, I just wish she could be coming every day. I know how you feel by seeing someone who likes you. But keeping a relationship with her is not a good idea. Mama, why is that? They are rich people and we are poor. For you to keep a relationship with her is not a good idea. I don't want trouble. But 
Rita is not a trouble person. I know she's not a trouble person. But when you keep a friendship with her, that's been strong for us. Grandma, I don't think there will ever be trouble between us. We are cool. Esther, just start getting ready. When I'm done packing, we are going. Eh? This is the third day and you're not taking a star route. You don't even want to tell me why. Uh, this route is shorter. No, Dad. It makes us six minutes late than normal. Rita, as you can see, I'm driving. If you don't want us to get accident, keep quiet. This is what you do anytime I bring up a discussion. You, 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 you talk me out of it. Why do I feel you're intentionally trying to keep me away from her? Why? What will I get? That's not what I'm doing. You know, that game makes me feel like she has another half of me with her. I... Uh, Dad, what, what happened? Listen, that girl is poor. You both are not of the same class. She can never be your friend. Do you understand? When I decide to come to London, I will let you know. Happy go to London, Ona, and there it be a man All right now. Dope. Dad, I want to visit Esther again. That's not possible. That was the first and last. How? I, I don't understand. Why? Listen, you will not visit that poor blind girl again, and that's fine now. Dad, she might be poor and blind, but she's my best friend. Sort of Monica Kobesti. You have many other friends in school. Feel free to choose another bestie. Feel free to visit any of them. But you see that poor blind girl? You will never set your eyes on her again. Dad! Don't hurt me. What am I going to do? I need to go to their house. But my parents wouldn't let me. Maybe I will just escape. Huh? They won't find out yet. That's what I'm going to do. Uncle Los Efe, when do we go? What have you done to me? I need you. Oh yeah. Believe me. Believe me. My, my dad is calling you. Eh. He said you should go. Ruth, go answer him. Eh, they hear my music. Yes, now. I beg, now pray, I pray. I pray. Be fast, he's calling no. your name. No. Be fast, though, before he gets angry. Rush now, rush, rush. Mm -hmm. 
There's something special about this connection. What about but so much commitment? There is something about me. Good afternoon, ma'am. Does your father know you are here? Yes, I, I sought his permission before coming. And he accepted? Yes. Do you think he will not allow me to see Esther? I didn't say so. I'm just surprised that you are here. Hey, your friend is inside. Ah, thank you, ma. I as a great band. Mm -hmm. Why, why this this girl go come tell me see or can find me inside? I just go inside. I know see Oga. Oga no they find me. You come make me. I just they run around like like mad dog. Which 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 kind which kind pranker pranker? With this this girl they use me me me. After how many years? Why don't they for for this, for this business? It's a great band. Chidi, have you seen my daughter? Uh, Madam, your your daughter. I know Siam. Have you seen my daughter? Oh, uh, madam, um, yeah, uh, yes. No, I know Siam. I know Siam. The fool. Where could she? Rita! Rita! Now they don't do me baptism now because of this girl. For this hot afternoon, I don't collect food. If she come inside now, come out, you go give me foolish, complete her. But why this gate they open? Who opened this gate? Because I know see, not only me, they lock this gate. Not only me give the password for this gate. Who opened this gate? Bill, I see, Bill, I see something that happened. Something where I never where I never understand it happened. Make you no come be waiting at the tinko. Make you no come be waiting at the tinko. I be old man for this for this security work. Oh. Eh? Why why this this girl go come tell me see or can they find me inside? You have to go back to your father's house. This is not right. They might be looking for you. Mom, please. Let me just stay for one hour and I will go. No. Go back home. You would have told your parents before coming. I did. I told them. But they won't let me go. I paid very high transport to come here. I don't want to waste it. Just an hour and I will go. <laughs> Mama, please. Just let her stay. Please. What if they look for her and discover that she is here? But Mama, she says she will just stay for an hour and you leave, please. Please, Ma, please. An hour, you will leave? Mm. Yes, I promise. You promise? I don't want your parents to come here to be fighting me. No, they won't. They won't even notice I've left the house. Mm. Uh, yes, they won't notice. Mm. No, I promise. Please. Just an hour, you will leave. So you keep to your promise? Yes. Okay, no, I, I'm, I'm just being scared. I don't want trouble. I don't have strength. That is why. Mm, Mama, mm -hmm. can she stay? Yes, let her stay now. <laughs> Mama, thank, thank you. Thank you so much, Ma. Thank you. Ma, thank but, you so much. But just keep to your promise. Yes, she will, you. Mama. Okay. Thank you. Ma, thank you. How have you been? I'm fine. I've missed you so I've much. I've missed you too. <laughs> Oh no, I miss you. <laughs> Did you see her? I've searched everywhere. She's nowhere to be found. Where could she be? I don't know. Could it be that she's hiding somewhere? No. Trust me, she's not in this house. She left after pranking the gate man. Uh-uh. My daughter would never do that. You never can tell. Children of these days are unpredictable. Well, if 
even if she did, why would Chidi allow a little girl prank him? Huh? That makes Chidi a stupid get man. I will visit his case file later. Oh God, where could she be? Look, if anything happened to my daughter, I swear. No, to you God. don't have to swear. Talk to your daughter. Yes, talk to your daughter because she is getting on my nerves with her mischievousness. Talk to her. That's your way, Nachin. It's my daughter's fault now. Huh? So it's my daughter's fault now. Look, God knows if anything happens to my daughter, where Chidi will have me to deal with. There's something special about this connection. What about but so much commitment? There is something about me and you. You know, I forgot my phone at home. I know my parents will be calling me. They must really love you. Yes, they do, and I love them too. <laughs> Rita. Do you think my parents will love me if they were alive? Of course they will. You are that child, so why wouldn't they love you? They will. Rita, ma, we've not gone yet. Yes, ma. Can we make it two hours? Rita, it's been over one hour now. Eh? Please, you have to start going now. Ma, please. I don't have any, I, I don't have strength for your parents' problem. Biko. Biko. Mama, please. Please let her stay, please. I beg you. Just two hours and then she'll leave. Yes, if I don't go, chase me. Rita, from one hour now to two hours. Maybe from two hours now, you tell me that you want to sleep over. No, 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 no. just two hours. Two hours. Something special about this connection. What about but so much commitment? I told you your grandma will listen to us. <laughs> you know, my grandma is a very good woman. Yes, she is. You're my bestie. I want to be with you every day. There's something special. About me and you, and I call it a great bond. Great bond between me and you. You're like a sister and the best thing. Great bond, a system between me and you. Something unexplainable. Great bond. I, I have been driving for almost an hour now, without knowing where I'm heading to. I don't even know where I am going to. Blind girl. Yes. yes. A system between me and you. Something unexplainable. Great bond. There is this connection. It's mysterious. So yeah. I cannot let you go. Something special about this connection. What about but so much commitment? There is something about me and you. Like that magnetic. But I cannot play safe. Chimo. What is it? My dad. My dad is here. Jesus. God, I'm dead. Hey! <laughs> Dad, Dad, you're welcome. Sir? Are, are you stupid? You are becoming stubborn and stupid and I don't like it. Get on to the car. They are fond of each other. Madam, you are not supposed to allow someone's daughter to stay in your house for too long. You want me to arrest you for kidnapping? Sorry, it's okay. Common sense should have told you that we, the parents, will be worried and searching for her everywhere. Dad, I, I told her you allowed. Shut up! Get into the car! I said, get into the car. Sir, sir, please don't do anything. Mother, 
shut up. You know that you're blind now, to Agaka. I told you. I told you I don't want your problem. Eh? Have you seen it? Have you seen it now? I told you earlier. All oh, these big men I don't need at all. I don't need their wahala. Have you seen it? Have you seen what you have cost now? A system between me and you, something unexplainable. Great bond, there is this connection, it's mysterious. So, yeah, I cannot let you go. Mama, please beg them to bring me that for me. Oh, Grandma, please. You know she's like a sister to me. I allow them to take her everywhere. Esther, what is wrong with you? Eh? You were here when her father scolded me for, for keeping her in my house. Eh? Do you want to bring trouble for me? Grandma, you know that she's like a sister to me. You know I love her so much and you allow them to take her everywhere. She is a friend, not a sister. So let her go to her house. Both of you will meet next time, okay? Well, Grandma, well. Oh, Grandma, please. I don't want her to ever leave me, please. It's okay, stop crying. No, stop, no, stop. no. Stop, stop crying. Mm -mm. Stop crying, no? Mm -mm. Don't, don't bring stop, with stop. her for me. Okay, stop crying, stop, stop. <laughs> I don't want to see me there. Don't worry, both of you will see me next time. When will you bring? Nonsense. You are in trouble. No, you are in trouble. Huh? How could you? You have the guts to sneak out of our house. You sneaked out at this your age. No fear. You see what I'll do to you? What if something? Happen to you? What if something bad happened to you? How would we know? Eh? That is the only friend I have. Don't tell me that bullshit. You have other school friends, don't you? You have classmates. No, Esther is the only person I want to. I want her to be my friend. I want only her to be my friend. I want her. My friend, will you shut up? You're not serious. You're not just serious. You don't even know what you want. Let's get home first. You are in trouble. Just know that you're in trouble. I'm looking for a better punishment for you. A defeating punishment. Your daughter is still crying. I don't care. I'm adding no TV to the list. What? You might as well kill her if that is what you want. I want her to go to boarding school. Is it because of what happened today? I just don't want her around here. Come on. Our daughter has a problem with socialization. And this one time she makes a friend, we're going to deprive her from it. Why? I just don't want it. No problem. All right? But I don't see anything wrong in her being friends with Esther. We should be encouraging her, not changing her school. Listen. I pay her school fees. For that reason, I decide which school she goes to. That is selfish. That is not fair. Please. I don't want to take chances. I am as a creep on. 
There's something special about this connection. What a part, but so much commitment. There is something about me and you. Like a magnetic But I cannot place it. Just like sisters, you're my bestie. I wanna be with you every day. There's something special about me and you. And I call it a great bond, great bond between me and you. You're like a sister and a bestie, great bond existing between me and you. Something unexplainable, great bond. There is this connection, it's mysterious. So yeah, I cannot let you go. There's something special about this connection. What a part, but so much commitment. There is something about me and you. Like a magnetic can... Rita. Mom, just go away. Honey. Just the same. Look, your father wants nothing short of the best for you. Seriously? Including beating me from seeing the only friend I have? Do you know what? Just open the door so we can talk about this, alright? Never. Just leave me alone. I want to be left alone. Rita. Rita. There's something special about this connection. What a part, but so much commitment. There is something about me and you. Like a magnetic But I cannot place it. Just like sisters. Listen. Sorry, oh? Sorry. So much. How can I see my friend? Hmm. You and I know very well that can't be possible. Her father don't like us because we are poor. Hmm? Mama, what if you tell him I'm very sick and I want to see her? Well, allow me to see her, right? Esther, your illness cannot change his mind. Just, just calm down first. And just get well. Oh, get well first. Oh. So, so, I don't want to go to the boarding school. Look, I have spoken to your father, but he won't budge. Why? Why don't dad want to see me around, Esther? I'm not doing anything bad. I know. Of course I know you are not doing anything bad. But he has his reasons. What reason? Tell me. Is it because she's blind? Yes. Dad don't want to see me around Esther because she's blind. Honestly, sweetheart, I do not know. All right? But... But in school could be fun, you know? I don't want to go. <sighs> Listen. There is nothing I can do about this. There is nothing you can do about this. The earlier you accept this and move on, the better. Okay? Fine. But at least, can I see her before I go? Please. All right. I'll see what I can do, but I am not making any promises. I'll try, okay? Thank you, Mom. Of course. Come here, baby. <laughs> you see, but in school, it's fun. <laughs> <sighs> mm. 
There's something special about this connection. What about you? Now, why are you squeezing your face? It's cool, you're going to. You're not going to die. Huh? Don't worry, I promise you, I'll call your friend. I'll check up on her. Make sure she's okay. Okay? Smile a little now. Mm -hmm. Your father is waiting for you outside. Don't worry, I'll help you with that. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome. Existing between me and you, something unexplainable. Great bond. There is this connection. It's mysterious. It's a food. I'm hungry. Why you are not hungry? But you've not eaten anything since morning. Please eat your food. Much I'm hungry. Me time will be coming again, right? Who said so? Hmm? What is what is good about this Rita that you love her so much? I don't know. I just love her so much. I don't want her to ever leave my side. I love her so much. I feel good around her. She told me her dad does not want her close to me. That is why he made her go to boarding school. Now she won't be close to me again. Don't worry. Just eat your food. Hmm? I don't I'll want. Make, I'll make her to come back. No. Is it because I'm blind? No. Who said so? He does not like me. No. No. She loves you so much. Okay. Eat your food. I'll make her to come back. I don't I trust promise you. you. You don't trust your grandma. No. You don't trust me again. Mm -mm. Okay, just trust me. I'll make her to come. I'll just eat your food first. Tell her to come. When she comes, I'll eat. Please now, eat your food. Mm -hmm. Good morning. Good morning. You're now with your granddaughter. She doesn't want to leave the house. She is so sad since her friend left for boarding school. Her friend? Yes. She of her friends. Her father's August daughter now. Uh -uh. Are they friends? Yes, so. She likes my granddaughter so well. Very, very well. How did she know her? Hmm. How did she know Esther? My sister, she saw her at the shop the day they came to buy her car. Since then, they start fret. <clears throat> Please don't just start. What but, is problem? <clears throat> but I've not said anything. It's just that like, that uh, West fly. Please, 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 please. I didn't say anything, no. But how can they start liking each other like that? My friend, please bye bye. We go bye bye. Oh, bye bye. Greet her for oh. me, oh. Mm. Nah, sure. Rita for me oh. I will, I will, I will. He's been acting weird lately. Do you think he knows? I wouldn't know. Mercy, one thing is sure. He is going to find out this mess by himself someday. And the earlier you let him know by yourself, the better for you. Wait, 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 wait. Are you by any chance suggesting that I should tell him myself? That's the only way out. Uh-uh, no. No, no, I can't. <laughs> That's still your choice. But just be ready to bear the consequences when it explodes because it's going to explode someday and it's not far again I've said my own and I've done my part Since of the past is coming to me something I did out of arrogance then oh, how can I face it oh it's so shameful how can I stand this the smoke from the fire of yesterday has blinded my headway. How can I face it? Oh, how can I stand it? Oh, we 
wish the grand can open up Come and swallow me Swallow me Cause I'm ashamed of myself You're weak. Why are you not sleeping? I don't feel like sleeping. Is something wrong? Huh? I said I don't feel like sleeping. Do you know, for some time you've been acting strange. You're always quiet, you keep to yourself. Is there something I need to know? You, you, can't, you can't tell me. Scenes of the past is coming to me. Something I did out of arrogance then. Now you want to sleep. Is it always so shameful? How can I stand this? The smoke from the fire of yesterday has blinded my head way. How can I face it? Oh, how can I stand it? Oh, I wish the grand can open up. Come and swallow me. Swallow me. Cause I'm ashamed of myself. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Come up and up. Come just swallow me. Oh. How are you? I'm fine. I know you're surprised to see me. Never mind. What of Esther? Esther is inside. Okay. She's fine. This is for you. Yes. Buy whatever you want with it. Why are you giving us money? Charity. Charity. Yes, let's just say charity. Thank you very much, Mama. I'm in a hurry. I have to leave now. Okay. Bye bye, oh. Right. I will watch you, oh. My regards to Esther. Father gave me some money to buy something for you. I don't want his money. He turned his money back to you. He took it away from me. Do you know what this money can do for us? You should be happy. I'm not happy. Mama, he took my friend away from me. I don't want his money. I want to leave with that. He turned his money back to him. He's the one who's the eh? Eh? What is wrong with this girl? Eh? This girl don't we turn his money back to him. It's not both of us that will use his money. Eh? Let me get his girl like you wear that you Eh? Hey, go, Ivo. Just imagine. How will we can wear that you go to go to This is so just a amount of money. Hey, hey go, Ivo. Yes, please, I am. What? Uh, what is wrong? What is at least wrong with her? Is she okay? And Hello? something special Hello? about this connection. What about but so much commitment? There is something about me and you. Like that magnetic But well, I cannot play safe yeah. Just like sisters yeah. They're my besties yeah. I wanna be with you every day yeah. There's 
there's something special about me and you, and I call it a great bond. Great bond between me and you. You're like a sister, and the best thing, great bond, a system between. Thank you for the snacks. Are you also angry like that because I'm back? Are you okay now? Yes. If you and dad sent me back to that boarding school, I would die. What? Baby, don't say a thing like that. Why will I not? Why will you send me away so I can stop seeing my friend? The next time you and dad send me back to that boarding school, mom, I will kill myself. I knew this won't last. I knew she wouldn't stay and you knew that too. Let's not take her threat lightly. This is not normal. How do you mean? What do you mean, how do I mean? If you don't understand, rest. Wait, I do not understand. Listen, stop asking me unnecessary questions. Why are you getting angry? I just asked you a simple question. Well, listen and listen real good. I am not minding her threats. She is going back to that boarding school and that's final. Why is he getting angry for just a question? Why, why, why is he, why is he, why is he mad? I miss Esther. Mom, I want to see her. Excuse me? Yes, I, I want to see Esther. Rita, you're barely one day old in this house and you're talking about seeing Esther. What's up with you and that girl? Is this the reason you faked sickness and so that we can bring you back home? Fake sickness? I don't fake any sickness. I'm just missing her. I want to see how she's feeling. I've not seen anybody. Simple. Ha. Me, I, I will see Lester. I want to see Esther, Dad. I want to see Esther. Hey. Blood of Zachariah. Did you just see that? Just calm down. Eh? You know this girl is still a child. You are the one spoiling this girl. You keep tolerating whatever she does, all in the name of she's a child. When it, yeah, calm down. Eh? I'm sorry. But come to think of it. Are you sure there are no other reasons, I mean, why you don't want our daughter to associate to Esther? Because each time they mention this girl's name, you act strange. You get angry, like now. Is there something you're not telling me? of the past is coming to me something I did out of arrogance then oh how can I face it oh it's so shameful how can I stand this the smoke from the fire of yesterday has blinded my head way how can I face it oh how can I stand it oh is the ground I wish the ground can open up. Come and swallow, swallow me. Swallow me. Cause I'm ashamed of myself. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Come up and up. Come just swallow me. Oh, if I can turn back the hands of time, I will right my wrongs. Sins of the past is coming to me. Something I did out of arrogance then Oh, how can I face it? 
Oga we dosa. Oga. Oga, I did great. Oga. Oga, good afternoon, sir. I say make a greet. What is it? Uh, okay. Um, not a, um, I... Shh. Get lost. Uh, lost. Uh, uh, okay. Greetings, sir. Get out of this place. Okay. Scenes of the past is coming to me. Something I did out of arrogance then. Oh, how can I face it? Oh, it's so shameful. How can I stand this? The smoke from the fire of yesterday. What? Is really going on. How can I face it? Oh, how can I stand it? Oh, I wish the grand can open up. Where are my children? Where are my daughters? Wait, I don't I don't have your children. Please, I'm here. Give me my children. What is it? Are you okay? Um, yes, I I can't sleep. I'm having a slight headache. <sighs> Drink water. been happening for a while now. I can't shut my eyes without seeing that woman trying to take my daughter away. That's so strange. I know. The strangest part of it is it's the same woman I see every other night. Are you thinking she could be the real mother? I don't know. I never met the real mother. It happened between my auntie and I. I still insist you let your husband know so that the both of you can find the real mother together. Please. And then what? Hmm? If I find the real mother, what next? Hand my daughter over to her? I wouldn't know. Oh, no. I am not doing that. That would be me jeopardizing my marriage by myself. No, that's a bad idea. So what do you want to do now? I don't know. But I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Mercy, you have to think very fast. Because you already know, you already know the consequences of your husband finding out this mess by himself. Think fast. You know, Maybe I should go see my auntie. I haven't heard from her in years. I'm sure she would have something to say to me or know something. You know, I don't know. I don't know. That's better for you. You have to do that. I need to go, all right? Uh, I'll let you know as things unfold. It's okay. You have been strong from the one. Keep being strong. Thank you. I'm here for you. Yeah. Mercy. Mercy. 
Oh. Are you okay? You're here. Yes, I'm fine. Are you sure you're fine? You were lost in thought. I'm alright. Thank you. Okay. I have an emergency, so I'm off to work. It's a Sunday. It's an emergency. All right. I'll see you when you're back. Come here. Thank you. You know, my dad went for a meeting. That's why my mom allowed me to come. Thank you very much for coming. I appreciate it. It's fine. I got you something. Oh, what is that? It's an MP3 with your music in it so that whenever you're bored, you can just listen to them. Oh, thank you very much. It's not in trust me. Feel it. I, I wish I could see it. But at least you can feel it. Hmm? Don't worry, I'll teach you how to use it. So, once you hold it like this, and you touch the first button, that is the only button. Okay. So you press it for long. She was so happy when I gave her the I even taught her how to operate it and she grabbed it very fast. You don't see. <laughs> yes, mom. She must be very happy to have you as a friend. Of course. Mom, are you okay? Why do you ask? Your mood just changed. Oh, never mind. I'm fine. Sweetheart, I'm going to let you rest now, okay? Okay, Mom. I love you. And I love you so much. I'll see you. <laughs> Nothing, all right? No, on the contrary, I have had a lot on my mind lately, and I would want to discuss something with you. Okay. I'm all ears. I, I allowed our daughter to see the blind girl. Excuse me. Yes, I had to do that. You know, they need to be together. They, they are friends. No. You took Rita to the blind girl without my consent. Are you serious? I, I just feel there's something about that girl that you're not telling me. Why do you hate her family suddenly? Huh? They're, they're young. We should allow them to be friends. I can't believe we're exchanging words because of that poor blind girl. As you can see, I'm tired. When I sleep and wake up, we shall decide on that poor blind girl. Oh, I, I, come, come. You took my daughter to see the blind girl without my consent. No problem. Let me work up to her. Once I wake up, we have to find out she will not. No sense. Yeah. I heard you visited Esther yesterday, two or four.
Rita, you are becoming very stubborn and disrespectful. And I don't like it. But that Esther told me you visited them and offered them money to take care of themselves. And so? Mm? Is that enough reason for you to visit them as well? Wait, what? Honey, what's she saying? That's not what we are talking about. No. Okay. But is it true what she just said? Yes. You visited them and you gave them money? Yes. What do you even want? You are scolding my daughter for visiting the same girl you visited and gave money. I don't understand. Well, I felt for the poor blind girl. That is the same way I'm feeling. Uh uh. I need an explanation. Please. You know what? I don't have time for this to conversation. Alex. Alex. Alex, you still haven't told me what you went to do at Esther's place. But I already told you. I visited them and dashed the money out of pity. Is that all? You think it's not all? Well, I wouldn't know. That is why I am asking you, so you tell me. But I already told you. I went there and dashed the money out of pity. Simple. You wouldn't let your daughter associate with this family. And all of a sudden, you have become a philanthropist, going about giving money to Esther and her family, the same family you were against. Is that something you are not telling me? I'm tired of this conversation. Change topic. Huh? You better be telling me everything. Just better be. Alex, I hope that is all. Hmm. Okay. Oh, how can I stand it? Oh, I wish the crank can open up. Come and swallow me. Swallow me. Cause I'm ashamed of myself. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. The hands of time, I will right my wrongs. Sense of the past is coming to me. Something I did out of arrogance then. Oh, how can I face it? Oh, it's so shameful. How can I stand this? The smoke from the fire of yesterday has blinded me. What like all this for us to visit? I'm here to see you. To see me, one day you look worried. Is everything all right? Talk to me. Who's the problem? Mama Ne. Who's the problem? I am sure my husband is hiding something from me. What could it be? Could it be about that blind girl? There must be a reason he doesn't want Rita to visit her. I have applied all the trick I can to squeeze the truth out of him, but he keeps avoiding it. I think I should visit Esther's grandmother. And what brings you to my house? I came to make a confession. Confession how? Your daughter won't let me rest. You mean Esther? No. You came? You came? You came who died 15 years ago? She won't let me rest. She comes to my dream whenever I close my eyes to sleep. 
She wants me to make a confession and tell you everything that happened. Confession about what? About her children. I still don't understand what we are talking about. Which children are you talking about, Biko? She gave birth to two children. Yes. One died and one lived. That was what I told you. It wasn't so. They both actually lived. So you lied to me. Mawane, you lied to me. I am sorry. My brother's daughter had the problem. Her child died in her womb just two weeks to her delivery. So I had to swap the baby. But I was there when my daughter gave birth to the children. After a few seconds, one died and other lived. I made it seem like that, but it wasn't so. My do brother's daughter, her marriage was at the verge of breaking up because of childlessness. Mercy, this one you came to see me today in my maternity home. I hope all is well. I know you will not come to your auntie's place to give birth. You'll always go to all those your big, big hospitals. So what brings you here today? I hope it's not pregnancy related. But it is. Only that it is not what you're thinking. But well, what is it? My baby is dead. Your baby? Which baby? Huh? Which baby? The baby in my womb. How? I do not know. The doctor says they cannot hear his heartbeat. Oh my God. Auntie, this is not a time to lament. I do need help. And fast. I cannot tell my husband about this. If he hears of it, he's going to throw me out and marry another wife. Please, Auntie. You have to help me. So you want to swap your dead baby? Yes. There's a woman who is heavy as you are. And she's due this week. Are you going to help me? Why not? Yes. You are my brother's daughter. I would do anything for you. But what we are going to do, no ears, no eyes will see or hear about it. We have to be very, very careful. Be rest assured, Auntie. Thank you. You don't need to tempt me. You are my brother's daughter. I will do anything for you. There's nothing I cannot do for you. Scenes of the past is coming to me. Something I did out of arrogance then. Oh, how can I face it? Oh, it's so shameful. How can I stand this? The smoke from the fire of yesterday has blinded my headway. How can I face it? Oh, how can I stand it? Oh, I wish the ground can open up. I the ground can open up. Come and swallow me. Swallow me. I'm ashamed of myself. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Come up and up. Come just swallow me. Oh, if I can turn back the hands of time, I will right my wrongs. Sins of the past is coming to me. Something I did out of arrogance then. Oh, how can I face it? Oh, it's so shameful. How can I stand this? The smoke from the fire of yesterday has blinded my headway. How can I face it? Oh, how can I stand it? 
I'm sorry, please forgive me. Come up and up, come just swallow me. Oh, if I can turn back the hands of time, I will right my wrongs. Oh, sense of the past is coming to me. Something I did out of arrogance then. Oh, how can I face it? Oh, it's so shameful. How can I stand this? The smoke from the fire of yesterday has blinded my headway. How can I face it? Oh, how can I stand it? Oh, I wish the ground can open up. Come and swallow me. Swallow me. Cause I'm ashamed of myself. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Come up and up, come just swallow me. Oh, if I can turn back the hands of time, I will right my wrongs. Sins of the past is coming to me. Something I did out of arrogance then. Oh, how can I face it? Oh, it's so shameful. How can I stand this? The smoke from the fire of yesterday has blinded my headway. How can I face it? Oh, how can I stand it? Oh, I wish the ground can open up. Come and swallow me. Swallow me. So, where is the other child? She lives at the other end of the, the village. I trusted you so much. I trusted you so much. I don't even know that you do such a thing to me, Monday. Upon the fact that my daughter did not survive the childbearing, Monday. I'm sorry. So, I have another granddaughter aside, Esther. Yes. <sighs> Monday. Monday. Please. Please come with me. Let me take you to where she stays so that I can be free from your daughter's torment. I'm sorry. Please stop crying. I know I have really wronged you. I am sorry. I'm very sorry. You betrayed me, Monday. I'm sorry. This is where my second granddaughter is. This kind of a big house. This is the place. Who are they? There are two women. I never see them before. Women? Yes, sir. Let them in. Hey! This man? Are you sure of what you are saying? Yes, I'm very sure. Mama Ne, right? Yes, I am Mama Ne, your wife's auntie. Uh -huh. Mama Esther. I hope all is well. This one, you people visited without announcement. It's your wife at home? Yes. Thank God. I want to see both of you. Sorry, ma, that won't be possible because I have an important meeting to attend. Nothing can be more important than what I want to tell you now. Really? 
Alright, How can I face it? Oh, how can I stand it? Oh, I wish the ground can open up. Come and swallow me. Swallow me. Cause I'm ashamed of myself. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I don't know how to start saying this. You don't have to say say anything. <laughs> what I mean is, I I just feel it better not be what I'm thinking. What is going on here? Hmm? Can someone talk to me? Is your daughter at home? No, she's in school. Thank oh God. That girl is not your daughter. <laughs> yes. This is a joke, right? You have to understand. I am not here to spoil your marriage. But is it my conscience or the ghost that is haunting me? I I can explain. Um the thing is, you know, when I was when I was pregnant for our for our daughter, I no, I when I was pregnant for our daughter, I, I, I lost the baby. And I, I didn't know how to tell you that, knowing how you would react. I, I, I went to my auntie and begged for her help. So she helped me swap the dead baby. And that is Rita. Tell me this is a prank. This is a prank, right? The real mother of that girl is her daughter, Nkim. She gave birth to twins, and Rita was one of them. So, you lied to me. I'm sorry. They did it for us, for our family. I promise I did it. You mean we have been living under the same roof with such a lie? I'm sorry. Please. Just... I have something to say. My daughter told me something before she died, when she was pregnant. Mama, I had to do it. There was no other way for me to save his life. I cannot help but think that this pregnancy does not belong to him. Stop crying, stop crying. Just tell him. 
Explain it to him. He will understand. What have I done? What have I done to myself? What have I done to myself? It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Hey! So you mean you slept with my boss? Eh? You slept with my boss, Chineke Nname. Hey! What did you want me to do? Chineke! What did you want me to do? Did you want me to let you die? I had to do something. I had to don't, do don't, something. Even, don't even try to twist this right now, alright? Do not even try to make this up. You slept with my boss. You opened your life for my boss. Really? After everything, after everything I've done for you. Please forgive me. What? What? What is, what is this? What, what are you even talking about? Please. No, tell me. What? What is this? What's the meaning of this? Hey, hey, just, 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 just. Let me be. All right. Let me be. You slept with my my own boss. Jesus Christ. I remember this is the height of it. This is the height of poverty. This is, this is the height of poverty. I am finished because I don't have money. My own boss slept with my wife. I am not even mad at you. I am not even angry at you. I am angry about my boss. I am angry with him. So he had this money all along. I've been going to beg him. Practically lay down for him. I worship this man. I did everything possible to make him happy. Despite my condition. And yet, he had to sleep with my wife just to bring the money. What is this? Eh? What is all this? It's okay. It's okay. End of loyalty. I am going to his house right now. I am going to face him man to man. I am going to face him man to man. Hey! Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Hey! You slept with my boss, Chineke. This is madness. This is madness. No, no, no. Mama, please. Hold your daughter. As for me, I am at my boss' place right now. I am there fighting him right now. He should explain to me why he slept with my wife for crying out loud. Leave me alone. Hi! As a matter of fact, if Esther is your daughter and she is the twin sister of Rita, that means Rita is also your daughter. My God. So why didn't you tell me about this all this while? I don't want to cause any problem because no one is sure of it. So you knew about this? No. Yes, you did. Oh my God, I'm, I'm such an idiot. Tell us why you gave them money to take care of your child and you stopped Rita from going to her. I didn't know about Rita. <laughs> yeah, right. Well, you do. I do not believe you. Alex, you slept with another woman. You pregnanted her. I did not do it because I thought she was my daughter. Oh yeah? So why did you do it? I did what I did out of charity. Oh yeah, charity. Hmm? Tell us why you did it. I mean, today is a day of truth, so you might as well open your heart and speak the truth, Alex. Shouting like a fool in my compound. Hey! You're calling me a fool? Eh? You're calling me a fool after all I did for you? You slept with my own wife? I think you've forgotten who you're talking to. Let me refresh your memory. 
I saved your life. Without me, you would have been dead by now. So you should be grateful to me. Without me, you would have been dead by now. And I will still have your wife. Hey! So be grateful. So you slept with my wife? You actually, he actually slept with my wife? So you had this money all along? Only for you to help me willingly? You just have to sleep with my wife to pay me the money? This is unfair. What if I refused to bring that money for your sickness? Hey! Won't you be dead by now? Hey! You will die now. I'm finished. And I will still have your wife. I am finished. You, you're a wicked man. You're an evil man. But guess what? The villagers will hear this. I will report you to the Igwe. I will report you to the king of this land. He must hear this. You slept with my wife, a woman I married with my other money. You slept with my wife. No. Bet me I will do it. You dare not. I will do it. This is end of loyalty. This is the end of loyalty for you. You, out of my heart. you slept with my wife. My boss slept with my wife. He slept with my wife. Not be A woman I married with my money. He slept with my wife. Okay, okay, sir. Okay, sir. He's right. Because I am poor. Because I am poor. He's calling me a fool. Hey, you! Because of poverty! Because of poverty! For bet me! Bet me! I will report you! This is not the end! This is not the end! I must report you! I will come back for you! Mark my words! I will come back for you! He slept with my wife! Not be me, now! He slept with my wife! Not be me now! Hey! Chine Kebe! Chine Kebe! You slept with my wife! You slept with my wife! Hey! Hey! You slept with my wife! You slept with my wife! Power, no be me now, no be me. No problem, no be me now. Tolo, Tolo, what's so special about your wife? You should be grateful that I touched your wife. Okay? Now who there on top now? Now the Will you shut up? Go back. Stand there, don't say a word. Don't say a word. I know, man. Hey! 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 It's good to make money. It's good to make money. You see this salary we got the family? I go to save up. I go make money, build this guy, build this guy house. Employ people. Driver. Uh, uh, flower people where they cut. Uh, people where they cut flower. Get man. I go tell all of them where they carry their wife come. I go sleep with their wife. Their wife go sleep with me. If you talk, I will tell you. Shut up. Shut up. Do you know me? Do you want me to disown you? Hi. Okay, sorry, sir. Thank you. Someone is spoiling my name. I want you to take his life. His name is Okechuku. If anything goes wrong, I will kill you. Nothing goes wrong when I'm involved. I don't know you. Someone recommended you. I repeat, make sure nothing goes wrong, else I will kill you. That's it, is it? Your job is done. I'll give you a feedback. Oh, how can I stand it? Oh, I wish the grand can open up. Come and swallow me. Swallow me. Cause I'm ashamed of myself. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. My boys delivered on my order. They made it look like an accident. That was it. I discovered Esther was his child when I took Rita there. And I became uncomfortable all of a sudden. Because each time I set my eyes on her, it reminds me of him. 
And at the same time, I feel so bad how the event affected her. Christ, what are you? A beast? What man kills another man and calls it an unfortunate event? What are you? Who did I marry? I'm sorry. No, you are not sorry. You are a beast. <laughs> Take it easy. Take it. This is not the time for all this. My granddaughter. Well? I have something to tell you. It's about your family. My family? Yes. Okay. I don't even know where to start. It's too confusing. You you can you can wait till you're ready. I don't mind. No. It must be now. It has been kept for too long. I thought you were dead. I was never dead. This is me. I'm alive. Okay, okay. Hey, so, be quiet. Sorry, sorry. Hey. But I'm there. Yeah. Hey, sit here. Hey, hey, hey. Sorry, yo. I'm sorry. Shut the fuck up! Sorry. I want to hear your voice, please. Hey, hey. Hey! Harry! Harry! Hey! He's my friend! He's my friend! Release Shut me! Shut the fuck up! Release me! Tell him to untie me, please! Harry, it's me! Okay, Chuku! It's me, okay, Chuku! Yes! It's me! Untie oh, me now! I've seen my friend! Fuck up! Fuck hey, up! Okay? Okay, Chuku! What if you go find big man trouble now? Bitch! Okay, Alex! What if you go find Alex trouble? Hey, Alex! Please, 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 I'm innocent, eh? That man slept with my wife! Alex slept with my wife! You know my woman who I'm married now? Yes! He slept with my wife! Please, untie me! Untie me, let me explain to you properly! See, please! See. Okay, Chuku, you don't fuck up. Oh. See, that man don't drop better alignment. I... Better one! The man don't drop better alignment, so... All my man are to just spy you. No, 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 please, I'm please. This guy. No, 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 Henry, please, talk, please help me out now. Help me, help me. You cannot kill me now. I'm your friend. Eh? He slept with my wife. He slept with my wife, my woman. He slept with my wife. Is that good? Is it good? Please help me now. Just untie me. Please, I beg you. Don't kill me. Please. So what do you want me to do now? Eh? What do you want me to do? Please, now. Just release me now. Let me go. Please, I beg you. Please. I will not go to him again. I promise you. Let me just go. Please, you can't kill me. My wife is pregnant and in no time she will deliver. Eh? Please now. You go no. See, see, the only way you can survive this man yeah, is to run far away from this village. Oh. Huh? Okay, okay, I will run, but please, I cannot leave this village without my family now. At least let me go and pick my family. 
My wife is pregnant, please. I will eh? leave, but let me go. You can pick my family. I see. See, brother, it's only the mad, Abby. See, first of all, try help now. Abby, you the mad. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. See, I'm sorry. See. Please don't shoot me. I'm your friend. You have to run away from this village. That's the only way I can help you. Because see, I know you. No be say, no be say one thing happen. Okay. To run from this village, make I know by you. Okay. If I see you close to this village or anywhere around this village, my I go, I, I go by you. Don't lose guard. Okay. Go, go collect. Don't leave me. Come on here. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you very much. Come, come focus on this place. If. If 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 you come out again, now you sabi. Oh, why you gonna let this guy escape like this? Now which level will be this one? Chill. It's like this now the matter don't cast. As far as saying no come back. Job well done. Now my man. No understand this matter. Oh. No understand this level. My hands no deal. Oh. I don't talk my own. Is that what you passed through? <sighs> that was how I. I left this village with that particular clothes I was putting on that day. I tried my best to, to erase the memory of this village, of this, this place, of the environment. But I kept seeing my late wife in my dreams not once not twice countless times she told me to come back and take what rightfully belongs to me is she her name is Esther is she my daughter? Yes. Wait. My daughter. You're my father. Yes. You're my father. And you're my daughter. Oh no. My daughter. Hi. My daughter. I wish you can see me. I wish I can see you. <sighs> My daughter. <sighs> it don't help me. Okay. I have something to tell you. Eh? So they're my children. But why didn't she tell me in my dreams? Maybe we didn't give her the opportunity to tell you more. Ha! Ah. I have twins. No. I want her back. I want my children back together. As a matter of fact, Mama, I am going to Alex's place. I must go there and see him and iron things out man to man. Please, at least rest. Tomorrow is a new day. Oh, be go. Be go. Just rest for today. Oh. Excuse me. Rest now. Tomorrow is a new day. Hi.
can't allow that beast have her and her sister after all he did to me. Never. I am ready to take his life if he dares me. We have to talk about this. I am very sure you are happy that those kids are yours anyway. How could you? How could you lie to me for so long? Because it's not about me. You impregnated another woman. Why still married to me? You cheated on me. Stop sounding as if I'm the only one who did something wrong here. Yeah. Had it been the child is not mine, that means that I would have been training another man's bastard all this while. What you did is deceitful and unforgiving. Let's call it spade a spade. Melalo. You don't want to Hey, Olu, I cover you. Who be that? Hey, the one from Goliath. I be David Nabanyo. Hey, Olu, I cover you. Ah, easy now. Huh? Hey, you don't go change your walk. You're welcome, you're welcome. I got flower. Hey! Hey! See new working uniform. From blue to black. Baba blue to baba black. <laughs> no, no, no. You're welcome. You're welcome. Blessing my air fresh I they say this I do. See as the smell. Hi! Where's Alex? Our guy? He day off. <laughs> Call him. Eh? Call him for me. Hey, hey, hey! We can call up for food. Look at color. See as you just fresh. Hey! Okay, oh, flower. See, see how you just the smell air fresher, air fresher. <laughs> this is your new work. Oh. You good. Eh? You even wear uniform, black and black. Hey. <laughs> make a make a colour. Make a colour. Hello? I'm sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Good morning, sir. Sa sa na 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 visitor you get to you you get visitor. Yes sir na 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 oga flower sir na oga flower. No no I no buy flowers sir I said na oga flower flower where they work for 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 you for us before. Oh, okay sir okay sir. This is my oga it takes I buy flower he he don't even he don't even recognize you again. In it. Nice, Alex. He, he, he come, our guy. Okay? He come. You know they smile. Being an assassin, you don't join. <laughs> ah, wow. Where is Alex? Now my guy, no be Alex, our guy. Our guy. He come. He don't forget to say. What's going on here? Go back to your duty post. Okay, sir. Nice one. <clears throat> I've seen the transition, so what are you doing here? Alex, I guess you're surprised to see me. Are you not surprised to see me? You thought I would die. I want to let you know something. I am unshakable. Alex, I am unbreakable. You can never get me. So, you slept with my wife. That wasn't okay for you. Then what gave you the 
the infantry. I want to know what gave you the temerity to take my child. You know what? Go inside there. Bring my daughter out right now. Are you talking about Rita? Alex, <laughs> you amaze me. You already gave her a name. Rita. <laughs> hey, comedian. Go inside right now and bring my daughter. Stop dramatizing and listen real good, boy. Before your wife died, she said it with her mouth that the children are mine. Get lost. <laughs> I am not afraid of you, Alex. You know what? I will see you in court. I will see you in court. I win for election, I will still win for God. Watch out. Need out of battle can stand. Oh, how can I face it? Oh, we so shameful. How can I stand this? The smoke from the fire of yesterday has blinded my headway. How can I face it? Oh, how can I stand it? Oh, I wish the ground. I wish the clan can open up Come and swallow me Swallow me Cause I'm ashamed of myself I'm sorry Please forgive me Who was that man that came here earlier? Oh, oh. Sweetie you have nothing to worry about, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I will be my... Oh. Okay. How can I face it? Oh, how can I stand it? Oh, I wish the ground I wish the ground can open up Swallow me, swallow me Cause I'm ashamed of myself I'm sorry Maria, there is real fire on the mountain And what could that fire be? I am still in shock To make matters worse Okay? The one my husband said he ordered for him to be killed He resurfaced Came by the house today Okay He is alive and what did he say? He is very much alive. He is demanding for his daughter. Can you imagine that? But I, I, I thought they, 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 they said... I know what he said. Now he's saying something else. He's saying his wife told him to go for what belongs to him. Huh? He wants Rita? Yes. This is serious. Very serious. The young man wants to go to court. Oh no, you, you guys cannot let him go to court. You, you, don't, you, don't, you shouldn't take this easy. What would you have me do? My husband is keeping Rita. He even wants to bring Esther to the house. And I know my husband, if he wants something, he would fight for it until he gets it. <sighs> the mother of the children said the children belongs to him. Yes, according to Esther's grandmother. And the man is saying the children belongs to him too? Yes. It means no one is sure yet. It's not certain. Yes. No one is sure yet. Hold on. The best way to come out of this horrible situation is to go and run a DNA test. DNA test that will enable us to know who the children belongs to. You're right. Yes. That's the best way. Don't be scared. Be strong. We're gonna fight it. I'll tell my husband about us. 
You have to. Thank you. Be strong. I know what to do. This time around, I will finish him completely. Nonsense. Honey, you calm down now, eh? You're getting yourself worked up. And I don't want us to take this too far. Meaning? Meaning we should take it on a lighter note. I don't understand. What I'm saying is that you find time to sit and talk to him. We can go for a DNA test to know who the real father of the children. Can you hear yourself speak? I should call an idiot, a nobody. I should bring myself down and approach someone I'm not supposed to talk to. Is that what you're saying? I'm only making a suggestion. Your suggestion is not valid. Just calm down. Huh? Can you calm down and listen to me for once in your life since you got married to me? You never listen to me. Just listen to me this one time and, and, and do things differently. I won't. Can you take it easy? Listen. Your husband is a very wicked man. I know what I'm talking about. Yes, but you know what? I would deal with him personally. He thinks I'm still a small boy. He thinks I'm that gardener he used to know. For your information, okay, talking to you right now is a possessed being. I've made money. I make money every weekend. I would deal with him. First thing Monday morning, I will see him in court. I've already told him that. Okay, I understand. But you don't have to be like my husband. Eh? We can settle this out of courts. Let us settle this like matured people that we are. Biko, I'm begging you. Oh, really? You see, you're more reasonable. Now you want us to do it in a matured way? All right, fine. That is it's a nice suggestion, you know. No problem. But if he thinks he's smart, then I will show him that I'm smarter. Ah, thank you. Thank you for your understanding. Um, that will be all for now. Everything will be sorted out tomorrow, okay? I promise. All right, then. All right, it's a deal. Thank you so much. Bye. Alex, you think you can take what belongs to me? Never. I make money every weekend. This is just the beginning. is ready. Okay, please get it for me. Honestly, doctor, I don't understand this result. What does this mean? Huh? Esther is not my daughter, but his. How? Please, explain further, because this thing here doesn't make sense to me. Yes. The DNA came out yesterday, and it says that Rita is yours, while Esther is his. You mean... 
I got my wife pregnant. The same day he got my wife pregnant. How is that possible? Yeah, it, um, it's rare, but it happens. It's a case we call Hector Paternal Superfacundation. Yes, let me explain. It's a case whereby a woman has sexual intercourse with two different men in the same time of her ovulation and becomes pregnant for the both of them. You're very funny, doctor. Honestly, you are very funny. Huh? Oh, you, you thought I don't know what is going on here? You thought I don't know? You're trying to manipulate the result just to favor him? I can never do a thing like that. Our hospital is a well-respected hospital. And I can never do anything to jeopardize the integrity. And if, if these results are not um, satisfactory to you, you can go ahead and check in other hospitals. But I assure you, you are coming back with the same result. How possible is that? Two men got one woman pregnant. It's a rare case, but it's real. of the past is coming to me something I did out of arrogance then oh, how can I face it oh it's so shameful how can I stand this the smoke from the fire of yesterday has blinded my headway how can I face it oh how can I stand it oh I wish the grand can open up Cause the man swallow me Swallow me Cause I'm ashamed of myself I'm sorry Please forgive me Come open up Come just swallow me Oh If I can turn back the hands of time I will right my wrongs Since of the past is coming to me Something I did out of arrogance then Oh how can I face it? Oh it's so shameful How can I stand this? The smoke from the fire of yesterday Has blinded my headway How can I face it? Oh how can I stand it? Oh I wish the ground can I wish the ground can open up Swallow me, swallow me Cause I'm ashamed of myself I'm sorry, please forgive me Where is my daughter? She won't leave her room Take me to her room hands of time I will write my wrongs all of the past is coming to me Something I did out of arrogance then Oh how can I face it? Oh it's so shameful How can I stand this? The smoke from the fire of yesterday Has blinded my headway How can I face it? Oh how can I stand it? Oh I wish the grand can, wish the grand can open up Swallow me, swallow me Cause I'm ashamed of myself I'm sorry, please forgive me Come up and up, come just swallow me Oh, if I can turn back the hands of time I will right my wrongs Since of the past is coming to me Something I did out of arrogance then Oh how can I face it? Oh it's so shameful can I see? How can I stand this? The smoke from the fire of yesterday Has blinded my headway How can I face it? Oh how can I stand it? Oh I wish the ground can I wish the ground can open up Swallow me, swallow me Cause I'm ashamed of myself I'm sorry Please forgive me Um Rita You don't want to live with me 
See, I understand that you have you stayed here all your life. But it's time to face reality. You're my daughter. I am your biological father. How about my sister? I now have the chance to stay with her. Yeah. I've been having, as a mother of father, I've had a series of dreams about your mother telling me to come for you. My mother. How was she? How did she look like? Oh, your mother was the, the most beautiful woman ever. Very beautiful. Just like you. Your mother loved me with everything in her. She loved me so, so much. But she did something wrong just to save my life. But that was in the past anyway. Did you marry another? No. You really want to stay here? Yes, Dad. Listen to me, Rita. I'm always here for you. I'll be available for you whenever you need me. Please, do not hesitate to call me whenever you want to see me. I beg of you. Okay, Dad. I wronged you in many ways. On a normal ground, you are not supposed to forgive me, which is understandable. But please, because of these children, find a place in your heart to forgive me. I'm sorry for all I did. Okay. Please forgive my husband. Dad. Please forgive him. You're the best man I've ever known. Allowing me to be with my sister shows how good you are with a good heart. Please, forgive him, please. Please forgive him. Please. Forgive him because of both of you. Mr. Alex, I have forgiven you.
It's a great bond. There's something special about this connection. What about but so much commitment? There is something about me and you. Like a magnetic fire. I cannot place it. Just like sisters, you're my bestie. I wanna be with you every day. There's something special about me and you. And I call it a great bond. Great bond. Sister and the best team, great bond, a system between me and you. I'm, I'm grateful. I didn't do anything for you. It was your child I raised. Uh, yes, but you raised her well. At least that is enough. And Mama, from my little findings, I, I mean she's she's well mannered and I like that. Oh, right. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. You're welcome. God bless you. And then, um, Mother, there's something you must know. My late wife, your daughter, was the best thing that happened to me. I loved her so much. In fact, I cannot love another woman because I still love her. And even tomorrow and forever. So, you, you're my best mother-in-law. You're still my mother-in-law. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Yes, you're welcome. I better to take my leave now, but before I go, I have a little token for you. Excuse me. Please manage this little token. You call this little token? Oh. Yes. Thank you very much. You're welcome. God bless you. God bless you. The thing is, I don't want you to stress yourself again. I, I want you to always relax. I mean, look at your age. You're not getting younger. You need to relax. Anything you want to buy, use the money. You can even send, you know, children to get it for you. Please, just relax yourself. Whatever you need, do not hesitate to call me. In fact, as a matter of fact, I, I'll be sending you um, money monthly. Let's just call it your salary. Hey, wow. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Um, that has always been in Kim's wish. Oh. She has always wished for you to be taken good care of. Thank you. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Mm. God bless you. You're welcome. I will see you when next I come visit in the village. Okay, okay. All right. Take care of yourself, please. If you need anything, you just call me. I will. All right? I no matter will. what it is. Take good care of yourself, eh? Bye-bye. Drive safe, please. All right. Uh, it's a great band. There's something special about this connection. What a part, but so much commitment. There is something about me and you. Like a magnetic fire. I cannot place it. Just like sisters, you're my bestie. I wanna be with you every day. There's something special about me and you. And I call it a great bond. Great bond. Sister and the best team, great bond. A system between me and you, something unexplainable. Great bond. There is this connection, it's mysterious. So, yeah, I cannot let you go. Something special about this connection. What a part, but so much commitment. There is something about me and you. Like a magnetic fire, I cannot place it.